Hello, everybody. How are you? Welcome. Good to see you. Hope you are well. It's what day is it? Saturday. It's the weekend. Well, yes, yeah, the weekend. Saturday is here. And we're just chilling. And we're spinning. And we're lurking and we're smirking and we're possibly working today. Welcome in. How are you? Yeah. By the way, Alana Lassa, Alana Lassa, thank you for becoming a member just now. That was very kind of you. Big ups to you. How are you? Good to see ya. Good to see ya indeed. Yeah, so we're gonna continue today's Coral Island. We will be progressing into the summertime. So that shall be a good. Later this afternoon, we will be doing a members live stream. We'll be doing some Jackbox in the afternoon and evening. So if you are a member, you can join us for some Jackbox uh, shenanigans, so to speak. Other than that, that's all I got for you. It's today and it's Coral Island day three. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Good to see you, Lady Dash. Welcome in, Anna Maria. Welcome in. Yes, Sebastian. How you doing, Sebastian? Good to see you. Welcome in, Jonathan. Hello, Jonathan. Anna Maria. Welcome in, Anna Maria. Chibi. Hello, Chibi. Hello, Susie. Welcome in. Yes, yes, yes. Maya J. Hello, Maya J. What's going on? Alana Lassa. Hopefully, I say your name right. I don't know if I am or not. Hello to you, though. Welcome in. And Celine, Celine, Celine Blood. Hi. How are you? Welcome in as well. Good to see you. Good to see you. Hello, Aunt Captain. How are you? Welcome in. Yes, yes, yes. Alexander. Hello, Alexander. How's it going? Yeah. Hunterman. How's it going? Lefunia. How's it going? Dylan. How's it going? What else do we have? Uh, Lissy. How are you doing? Barb. How's it going, Barb? Yeah. Malachi. Hello, Malachi. Yeah. Alexander Pierre. Welcome in. Baby Spice. How are you, Baby Spice? Good to see you. Welcome in. Yeah. Fiona. Hello, Fiona. Maris, good morning to you, Maris. Or maybe good morning to me, but also good evening to you. How are you, Maris? Good to see you. Yes, you said it right. Oh, thank God. Good. I'm, I'm glad I said it somewhat right. <laughs> Welcome in, everybody. It's Coral Island Day today. Um, don't, uh, well, I, I don't want to say I don't have any plans today, but I, I mean, I do. We want to get to the summer. Uh, we want to progress, obviously. You know, all the good stuff. It's actually raining here today pretty heavily where I, li where I live. So I decided to hook up a hoodie, another one, because it's cold. I mean, 55 degrees heavy rain. That's a cold day, right? No? All right. Very well. How are you, Executor? Good to see you. Hello, Darcy. Welcome in. How are you? Good to see you. Welcome, welcome. Yeah. All right. Here we go. Send it. Send it. Play? Play me. Ooh, don't confuse me, though. Um, that one. Yes, that one. You have a drawing pad ready for Jackbox? Oh, that's exciting. I love when people have the drawing pads. Because they make awesome stuff. They make incredible stuff. It's raining there as well. I'm loving it. I'm loving the rain. I'm all about it. The dogs? Not so much. They're not loving the rain. But I'm loving the rain. Um, it took them a while to go to the bathroom this morning, but you know, that's to be expected. What can I tell you? You gotta go outside, you gotta go outside. It is what it is, right? That's the, uh, hierarchy we have here in this house. Hello! Fiona! Hey, Fiona! Thank you for becoming a member as well! How are you? Good to see you. Thank you for that. That was very kind of you also. Big ups to you, Fiona. Thanks for becoming a member. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate you. Hello, Aris. How are you, Aris? Good to see you, Aris. Who dat, dude? How are you, who dat, dude? Welcome in as well. Yeah. Yeah, so, um, we should be getting these crops all... Well, not should. We are going to be getting these crops done right before summer starts. And then maybe what I could do is we can plan out that the 28th... I will... I need to remember this. The 28th, I will upgrade my watering can, I think is what I want to do. And the money I, I, I get from all these two, I'll upgrade like a pickaxe and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> there we go. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. There we go. We'll get the carrots rolling. Mm-mm-mm. 
I'm trying to I'm trying my new airpods right now and can sound so funny oh god do I sound like I'm in a friggin tunnel hey do I sound all up in your ear is that what I'm sounding like hey Lisa how are you Lisa what's happening been playing Coral Island all morning oh very good Fiona love it there we are it's a nice game to relax to isn't it especially like on a rainy day right a nice rainy day a nice rain well at least for me nice rainy day chill day dark day i like when it's dark outside and uh just chilling and just having a good time there we go i don't know why i started chopping this wood i think i was just feeling myself right there so um yeah let's kind of have a uh let's have a direction right now uh, today's the 25th. Oh, crap. That means it's uh, someone's birthday today. Let's not forget about that either. Whose birthday is it? Let's see. Today's birthday is Macy. All right. Let's go see Macy. Where are you, Macy? You're in the Coral Inn. Might be too early to see Macy. Maybe not. You sound like you just woke up. Well, that's also true. Yeah, that's also true. I did just wake up about an hour ago. Still haven't, uh, still haven't kicked in. It does take me a while to wake up. And I don't have coffee today, so that's that. I don't have coffee because I was late-ish. Well, I wasn't late. To, well, what the hell? I need to go this way. I wasn't late to the party. It was the dogs that were late to the party. You know, when it rains outside, it takes a long time to let the dogs go to the bathroom. They have to, like... It's a, it's a whole ordeal, right? They made me late, and I was like, I can't make coffee now. Instead, I have to make like a giant thing of water and hopefully that will kick me going. And I'll be honest with you. It's not kicking me going. Sound like I'm trapped in a box. Well, that's also true. <laughs> See this box right here that we're in? I'm trapped in it. I'm literally stuck on the screen. Yeah. You just started playing Coral, Coral Island on the Xbox? How's that going for you, yeah? Is that going good? Going bad? I've seen mixed... I'm seeing mixed reviews. I'm seeing mixed reviews. Uh, people um, commenting on the on the VODs saying, um, you know, they're having trouble. Some of them saying they're doing just fine. I am curious to know what kind of Xboxes they're also running to. Maybe I should have clarified on that. Maybe, I don't know if they're using next-gen up you know next gen xboxes or if they're not i wonder is macy still in here she's probably outside now uh she probably is outside let me see are you outside macy where are you or are you sleeping macy it's your birthday come on birthday girl where are you oh god right you're in town very well she's shopping she's shopping she's shopping hey mad mad how are you good to see you what's happening hope you having a good day too welcome my dogs hate the rain? Yeah, my dog... Well, yeah, my dogs just straight up hate the rain. They said, this is the devil's work. I said, I don't know. They they look at me like I can turn off the rain. I can't turn it off. I'm sorry. I don't have a switch. They're so disappointed. They're like, really, human? You had to turn it on today? It's like, well, no, but... Stop. Stop. <laughs> just go. <laughs> just go. Mm -hmm. What time is it for you? It is 11 a.m. It is 11 a.m. Yes, yes, yes. 11 a.m. Let's see. Dun, 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 Macy, you need to hold still, girl. You are all over the place today. Hi, Macy. Happy birthday. Here we go. I can't believe you remembered my birthday. Thank you so much, Cans. No problem. And then let me talk to you. I don't get too stressed. Thankfully, it's one of the job perks. Oh, I'm always surrounded by nature and pretty things. It puts me in a good mood, always. Oh, very well. Very good. Okay, so the next birthday is on the 27th, which is gonna be the day I think, well, I guess technically I could do it the 20, actually, hang on. I gotta be careful what day the 27th falls on. Can I see a calendar? Yeah, the calendar back there. If it falls on a Sunday, then I can't upgrade my tools. So I gotta do it on a Saturday if that's when the 27th falls when does it fall on it falls on a Sunday so Pablo's birthday is on Saturday that's perfect what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do what I need to do with my watering can that morning I'm gonna see Pablo and then I'm gonna drop off my watering can get it upgraded things like that yeah hey Elaine how are you what's going on 
Hey, Alex, how's it going? Birthday's tomorrow. Gonna have a great day. Hey, happy early birthday. Absolutely. How are you? Yes. Hello, Alex. Awesome. Hello, Michelle. How are you, Michelle May? Hello, classy, cozy gamer. Thank you for the one month hype. Big ups to you. How are you, classy, cozy gamer? Anna, how are you, Anna? Good to see you. Welcome in. Hi, how are you? Okay. Um... Yeah, so that's gonna be my plan for the, um, for the, uh, the, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Pablo, Pablo, Animal Festival, Summer 12th. Okay, so that's when it is. Oh, Animal Festival. I don't know if I can get an animal before then. I think I need to get a certain town rank before I can do all that. Uh, let's go down to the ocean. Hey, Pamela, how are you, Pamela? And Sebastian! Sebastian! Thank you for the super chat, I appreciate that. Have a great stream. Thank you for that, Sebastian. I think it's going to pop up here in a sec. I'm, sometimes I'm a little early. Sometimes I'm, I'm a little late. You know, whatever OBS decides to do, that's what OBS decides to do. I appreciate that. Thank you very much, Sebastian. Big ups to you. Hey, Isabeau. How you doing? What's going on? Good to see you. Hey, Shay. How you doing, Shay? Welcome in. Hey, T. How you doing, T? And Sebastian. Have a great stream, Kans. Thank you, Sebastian. Appreciate you. Very kind. Nice. Uh, whoop. There we are. Oh, there we go. Yep. Let's continue. By the way, if you do become a member of the channel, make sure to go to the home chain, uh, home page, home page of the channel. Scroll all the way down. You can see all of our uh, members' videos and stuff like that, and members' live streams. And today, this evening, afternoon, depending on where you are, you will be able to participate in Jackbox. I will be hosting it. We'll have good fun. And hey, Elaine, thank you very much for becoming a member as well. Big ups to you. Thank you very much. Very generous. Everyone's starting off the stream very generous today. Thank you all. Appreciate you. Thank you for the kindness on this Saturday. On this cold, wet Saturday, if I can get this freaking thing here. Got it. Ah, yes, cannonball jellyfish. Nice. Oh, yes, we need more kelp as well. If we want to upgrade other things, which we definitely eventually want to, so it's fine. Mm -hmm. mm -mm -mm -mm. Hey Kim, how you doing Kim? What's happening? Good to see ya Red Star, how you doing Red Star? What's going on? Mm -hmm. Ooh, I guess I don't know if I have the slug yet I guess I don't have the slug Is that the slug? Yeah Here we go Museum, sea slug Yeah, I don't think I have that I do not <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah Welcome there Thank you, thank you. Copper. I'll take it. Um, I think we all... I think we only have exactly five... Well, actually, we might have six. Uh, coral sites done. But yeah, we're just taking our time. Mm. In case people are also new to the channel, if you're watching this live or if you're watching this in the VOD, I'll say this a little bit early on. Um, typically, how I do things around here on the channel is I am a... I'm a very soul let's player, um, which means that 98, 99% of the time, um, all my streams, all my playthroughs are always done on a live stream. I never play uh, these games ever offline because I feel like that is the let's play where we are playing together and we are experiencing it together. So, um, I don't do any, like, behind, like, the scenes where I'm gonna go and, like, get a ton of stuff off camera. I do everything live so that everyone can experience it, whether it's the highs, the lows, the grind, and so on and so forth. So, in case people are really new to the channel, that's how I do all the games here on the channel. So, I figure I let you, let you know about that. Hey, Panda, how are you? Hey, Lucy Roberts, good to see you as well. Yes, it could kind of like be a, a good, it's a good thing and a bad thing. Yeah, it's a good thing and a bad thing that I don't play these games off camera. Um, but I think in the long haul, long term, I think people really appreciate it when it's all done on camera and not kind of, you know, I don't know. It depends on who you are. Some people like the grind, some, some people don't like the grind. It all depends. There we go. Cool. Grab that. Activate that. Oh, good stuff. Good stuff. All right, very good, very good. Nice. <clears throat> hey, Jocelyn, how you doing, Jocelyn? Good to see you. 
What's happening? General Hazard says, I found you by watching your Lakeburg legacies. It looked like a super fun game. I'm also interested in this game, so it's cool you're streaming it too. Oh, very good. Cool. Yeah. If you like uh, farming sims like an RPG type game, this definitely will be a game for you. Uh, I kind of mentioned this yesterday. Top three favorite. One of my top three favorite um, farming sim RPG games out there. Yeah, absolutely. It's coming in third place, but it's still in the top three. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm coming live for the first time. I was watching episode two. Oh, well, then you are fresh right off the boat. Hello. Good to see you. Uh, let me head on over here down to the left and I'll bring the anchor over here. Hey, Kelly. How are you, Kelly? Oh, I guess we have to talk to Ling before we can do that. Is there wait? Can we go to the right then? Let's see. We need to visit Ling. That's one of our quests is to visit Ling. I think it's to actually get a better suit. Maybe I can't remember. But we'll place it right here for now. There you go. Mm -hmm. Hey, Leaf. How you doing, Leaf? I drop any series when someone goes and does hours off camera. Oh, interesting. Yeah, see, even when I watch series, I always... Like, when I'm watching Let's Play series, I always enjoy watching the full-fledged thing. Um, that's just something I've always enjoyed. When I'm watching a series and they come back with everything, I'm like, wait a sec. How did you get there? How did you get that? I want to see the... I want to see the struggles, right? So I've always taken that kind of uh, into my play, into my kind of ordeal here on YouTube. Nonetheless, um, let's go ahead and maybe donate. Do I have enough time to donate? Yeah, I do have enough time to donate. We'll go donate. <laughs> yeah, so if, you ever, if you're ever interested in Dinkum, um, <laughs> I have like 60 plus live streams hundreds and hundreds of streaming hours of dinkum everything that i do in dinkum was done live and not a single time was it ever done off live or off the camera so yeah i'm very proud of that freaking dinkum and it will eventually probably uh be added to on later in the future too as well two of those thank you mm -hmm. hey julie how are you julie Stardew is number one. <laughs> I would have to probably agree in the modern time. I said, but nostalgia reasons, I said Harvest Moon 64 was my number one and then number two was Stardew Valley. But then number three was like Coral Island for sure. Is there cooking in this game? There is cooking in this game. Yeah, once you get a, um, once you get a kitchen, you can get a kitchen, you get recipes and stuff, and you can cook and all that good stuff. Uh, I will throw that in there. What else can I throw in here? I can sell all these kind of shells. I don't think I need to donate any of these. Uh, nope. Nope. I can sell it. It's fine. There we are. I'm building materials. Boom, 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 boom. And then hold on to the coffers and the geodes. And we'll throw the stuff in here. <clears throat> Is this your third... Top, what are your top two? Yeah, Harvest Moon 64, number one, Coral Island, number two. Whoops. There we go. Mm -hmm -hmm. Ooh, free the earth giant. Is it raining tomorrow? It's going to be a windy day tomorrow. Very well. Tomorrow is the 26th. Yeah, tomorrow's the 26th. Wood tile. Relationship, Macy. Oh, very good. 365. Let's go. Mm -mm. Hey, subscriber. Thanks for subscribing, David. What's happening? Mm -mm 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 -mm. I would never yell at cans, says Susie. Susie, how dare you? How dare you lie to the folks? How dare you? Oh, look at that, though. We got some good turnips. Hopefully, this will take us to the next level. I don't think... Oh, these are ready, too. Oh, wonderful. Cool. Oh, yeah. This is about time. We got a lot of carrots in. All right. This is kind of us cleaning up, I guess you could say, for uh, for summer now. Awesome. I think I might actually potentially make sprinklers. Now, the last time I played through this, I didn't make a lot of sprinklers. I know we will get upgraded sprinklers soon, but maybe I just kind of, like add sprinklers for summertime also just to help out around the farm potentially potentially yeah so we have a lot here um i don't think there's 
we've offered that offered that offered that yeah we, we're, we're pretty good on the offering right now i think what i what i can do i i well yes no yes no yes no what i will do is i will hmm how do i want to do this i will keep some I'll keep this one. I'll keep some and some and sell the rest. Yeah. Yeah. I'll keep some and sell the rest. There we go. Let's do something like that. Boom, 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 boom. That's big money right there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How dare you? Do you just not play games in your free time or do you have secret saves for your eyes only? Um, no, I play games in my free time. I probably, well, most of the time I play different types of games uh, than the games I stream like every day just to break up the, uh, the genre and give me a good taste of other things. But yeah, I play different types of games. Mm -mm -mm. What, time, what day is it? 7.30. We can break it up. Actually, you know what? Let's go to Ling. We need to go to Ling, don't we? We gotta go to Ling. Yeah. Not what I wanted. Exactly what I wanted. Um, yeah. Visit Ling and defeat 30 enemies still. And museum. Okay, let's go to Ling and then maybe mine chef. Let's see that. Mm -hmm. I love farming sims, but I've seen hesitant about getting this one because I don't want it to be just like all the rest, but this one seems to have a lot of content. Okay, so this one, it will definitely be a very much like, kind of like the rest, um, but I don't know. There's a different thing about this. This game has a little bit more charm. This game uh, has more detail. I really like the detail. I really like this, the, the art style of it. I'm a big fan of the art style. Uh, the story behind it is fun. The dialogue is good. Um, I don't know. It's just another take of it. Yes, you could argue that it's kind of the same, but with the Merfolk Kingdom, and I guess now rumored to be the new Savannah area with the 1.0 release, that's always fun. Eventually, you'll have children that you can get in future updates, and then multiplayer will come to the game too in future updates. So I really want to see what this game is like during multiplayer. Perfect time for a carrot. I will accept that. Yeah, I will accept that indeed. Deliver a carrot to Yuri. I definitely will. But as terms of like, is this the game doing anything different in the farming genre? I don't think it's doing anything like groundbreaking different. I think it's just another nice taste, so to speak. Ah, Cans, welcome to the lab. I've been expecting you. Of course, I already know everything that happened while you were diving. You were able to activate the solar orb. I saw everything unfold from Ki uh, Kibble's point of view. Oh, very good. I'm glad the ocean finally found someone worthy. More importantly, I owe you an explanation. Please follow me into my secret lair, where I can explain things to you. Oh, your secret lair. This is where Susie takes me after stream. Where to start? Well, many years ago, I planted super corals, just like the one here, all around Coral Island. They've been specifically bred to survive rising ocean temperatures in hostile environments. The room we're in also holds um, murf, mm, ancient technology that can remove those stubborn oil-covered roots and heal sick coral. She takes me down to the secret layer and says, It's the freaking moss stone! Bop! What you saw in the ocean, how should I put it? At its most basic, we take a little bit of what makes a super coral healthy and share it with all of the other sick corals so they can get better. By combining human science, a little bit of magic, and the ancient technology, the ocean can recover. It's a lot to take in, and I'm sure you still have questions, but that's all I can share for now. 
Hey, Dark Dragon, how are you? Hey, Jennifer, how you doing? Hey, Kira, good to see you. Welcome in. The rest you'll need to discover on your own, though. As promised, the diving suit is yours to keep. Thank you. But, hmm, just one more thing before I let you go. I want you to know that although you've been deemed worthy, you aren't the only one out there that is worthy. Okay. Hopefully that didn't come across the wrong way, but I don't want you to feel like this is fate you can't escape. There's nothing worse than that. All right, very well. Thanks again for stopping by. No problem. Gans has PTSD? I do. She rocks my world. Okay, there we go. All right. So that's taken care of, yeah? So can we... Does that... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait. Yes, this. Yes. Okay, heals six... Yeah, six out of 20 coral sites. Um, very well. And then we could do this. Let's go do the carrot first. And I think I might go to the mine shaft. Actually, I won't go to the mine shaft. I think the next time I'll go to the mine shaft, because I need to do 10, uh, 10 levels in a run. I think maybe the next time I go is on a rainy day and prepare for that. Let me go get a carrot for Yuri. Yeah. <clears throat> Grab that. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Hey, Summer Sunshine. What's going on? How are you, my sunshine? All right. Daffodil. Grab the one carrot. Uh, we'll hold on to the uh, canola. Yeah, it's fine. Canola. Perfect. And then, uh, yeah, drop off the carrot and maybe go down back to the ocean, I guess. Tomorrow we're going to be, well, I can't remember. Is it five bronze bars or is it ten bronze bars to upgrade a tool? I think it's five bronze bars to up. Oh, man, I better be careful. I think it's five. I hope it's five. I guess I could check. Oh, man, let's go to Pablo first. It's five? Okay, good. Thank you. I wasn't sure. I was going to say we can prepare for the water cam, but if I don't have five bronze or if I don't have ten bronze bar, that's going to be an issue. I think I actually do have ten, ten though, altogether. So I don't know why I'm wearing anyways. I shouldn't even if it was ten. Touch the trash can, Chibi. Thank you. Okay. Let's go inside and talk to Pablo. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Hello. Pop it. Pink. Nice. Bink. Bink. Nice. Mm -mm -mm. Does the story play a big part of the game? Well, yeah, there's a story to it. Um, the whole reason why we're kind of like building up our farm, building up and cleaning out the ocean and things like that it has to do with like corporate evil people. Um, it kind of sheds light on Stardew Valley, which Stardew Valley kind of was the same way. Um, helping re revitalize the town over corporate uh what would you say corporate i don't corporate evils but i mean i guess that's one way to put it corporate evils corporate right? corporations in small towns Th that's the evil right so they're kind of similar similar in that that regard there we go let's see here i would like to journal i keep Pressing that button. Whoopsie. I need to find Yuri. Let me find Yuri real quick. Yuri, where are you? You're at the Sunny uh, Beach Shack. Very well. Sunny's Beach Shack. Farm versus Corp, essentially. And then uh, your grandparents left you this farm. At least in this game, I don't think... I am... Wait a sec. How do you get this farm in this game? I think you just... You just get it, right? Your grandparents don't. How do you get the farm in this game? Oh my god, I'm drawing a blank now. You show up on a chicken. And then you just take over the farm. Was it grandfather that that held on to this farm too? Okay, I wasn't sure if that they still went the same route. I guess they did, yeah? Um, is she not in here? She's in here. Where are you? No. There she is. There you go. Thank you. No problem. 
I was going to practice some volleyball earlier, but there was nobody outside. So I decided to chill here instead. I do like her too. I like Yuri as well. Yeah. I do like Yuri. Yeah. Walmart successfully prevented Target from building a new store because the site was protected wetland. They built a Walmart on the same spot two years later. This was Dalton, Georgia. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> That's the weirdest thing that I could have read for the first sentence that you decided to say today. Hello. Hi, how are you, Jefferson? Very well. All right. Did, did, did I miss something? Did I miss something? Did you say something earlier that I missed? Hello. Did something happen in your town recently? Or not in your town, but happen around your area? <laughs> Are you trying to put in an example of corporate greed? Is that what it was? <laughs> oh, look at her. Millie. I'm a well, I'm like a well-prepared scout. I got my flu shot early this year, so I'm fully equipped for the sniffle season. I don't think I've ever had my flu shot ever. Yeah. Hey, Cora. How are you, Cora? No, Grandpa. The mayor gives you the farm. Okay, so we don't get a grandfather in this one. It's the mayor that gives us the farm. Hey, Tolga. How are you, Tolga? Hello, Robert. How's it going, Robert? Hello, Daisy. Good to see you, Daisy. How are you? Okay, we'll drop off this stuff. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. I have enough of these flowers. I don't need to keep on to them. I'll hold on to the canola, though, regardless. That's good. There we go. All right, glass in there. That's actually good to have the more glass. And then the canola. Okay. And then the kelp. How did you never get a flu shot? Um, I just never went and got one. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I guess that's how you say that. <laughs> hey, Diane. How are you, Diane? Hey, Brittany. How are you, Brittany? Hey, Manda. How are you, Manda? Good to see you. They pretend to be... Uh, they pretended to care about the town, but they only cared about their profits. Jefferson, did you go into the garage today and smoke a bowl before you came to chat? <laughs> Pet race. Minigame is summer and is bugged. You got to restart the day if you play it. Wanted to give you a heads up. That's a great heads up. Um, that's, that's a good heads up. That's a good heads up. Thank you for that, Tolga. I'll make sure not to do that then. Bronze ore. Bronze kelp. Good stuff. You were talking about Stardew, Stardew two seconds ago? Yeah. Yeah. But you talked about Target and Walmart. Were you trying to compare and contrast? I'm I'm confused on this. <laughs> I'm confused. You got me all wrapped up. You said something about Georgia. Then you said something about Target. Then you said something about Walmart. Then you said some said something about corporate greed. Was that supposed to also kind of piggyback off of the uh, Stardew Valley thing I was saying <laughs> earlier? If so, hats off to you because you got me good on that one. I did not take that. There we go. Whoops. Nope. There we go. Okay. All right. Place this in here. The museum's looking amazing. It is. It is. It is. Uh, well, yeah, no. Well, I'll keep this outside, actually, because we know we're going to need it. Mm. Technically, you can actually buy a membership to Walmart nowadays. I don't know if that's a regional thing or if that's like a worldwide thing. Anybody know about that thing? You can technically buy a membership to Walmart. Walmart Plus. If you get Walmart Plus, you get free delivery and you get um, Paramount Plus for free as well. Mm-hmm. 
Uh, let's do some foraging. We don't have a Walmart. All right. Well, in that case, what the heck? I did it. Wait, does the UK not have Walmarts? Or is it just parts of the UK that doesn't have Walmarts? I guess I never really thought about that. There we go. Some wasabi. There we go. Some trash. <laughs> no Walmarts at all in the UK? Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. Not that I'm sorry that it's a bad thing. I'm just sorry that I've been talking about Walmart a lot in my last couple of months and all of you are like what the hell are you talking about interesting walmart it's regional interesting i mean it's a cool idea you pay like ten dollars a month or something i think no 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 and you get like free shipping to your house you get paramount plus you save on walmart discounts or whatever the frick they do i don't know if you're an average shopper i'm not a walmart plus member but yeah i was sad when sears closed yeah then i can't take my holiday freaking pictures anymore there we go mm. who needs a walmart when you have so many more it's true there you go. Mm -mm -mm. We've heard legends of the Walmart, but it's just stories to us. <laughs> Is there Walmarts in Australia? Can anybody confirm that? Is there Walmarts in Australia? No Walmarts in Scotland? No Walmart in Australia, but know about it? Oh my gosh. Okay. For some reason, I thought Walmart was like a very like very like i thought it was like a mcdonald's you know what i mean in terms of like locations interesting huh the more you freaking know i guess i mean you hear bad things about walmart regardless of it honestly if i wasn't doing <laughs> if i wasn't doing youtube i might pick up a job at walmart i'll be real with you you're telling me i can stock i can put my headphones in stock bo boxes in the middle of the night and have benefits seems like a pretty nice thing to do somebody's got to do it i'll listen to music all night or podcasts stocks and boxes and have full freaking nice benefits not a lot of people offer benefits here in the u.s because it's just too damn expensive especially health insurance Walmart tried in Poland, but it didn't win anything. Interesting. Hey, Kavastar, how are you? You have to do it in riot gear? Let's see here. Um, I will sell nothing. I'll keep... Uh, I'll sell the violet. Everything else I'll keep, though. There we go. There we go. Um, Wasabi. I'll keep that in another thing. I'll keep that in the vegetable. I'll hold on to the wasabi. Yeah, why not? There we are. And then that. There. There. There and there. Cool. We just got Costco here. Isn't that a North American chain? Yo, you got Costco? We have Costco. Costco's amazing. Costco is a serious job. If you can, it's so, so hard to get a job at Costco. But if you can get a job at Costco, whew, you're doing just, you're doing just okay. You're doing just good. Like they pay very well. They have wonderful benefits. They have uh, Sunday premium hours. So every Sunday, if you work on a Sunday, you get premium hours 52 uh day or 52 sundays of the year right it's a it's a really good job to work at costco and you get to dress somewhat casual too it's nice 
you're in the u.s and don't have a costco i don't know if costco is like a west coast central thing or i don't know is there costco's on the east coast all right today is the day today is the 27th we're gonna see pablo and we're also going to um upgrade our water can we don't need the water can for tomorrow because tomorrow's the 28th well maybe for the banana tree but that's beside the point but yeah let's grab the bars hey queen how are you queen there are a few costcos in the uk wow i did not know that interesting the more you know i guess that's awesome there's costcos on the east coast too mm -hmm. nice yeah costcos a really good job uh let's go there 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 uh, okay. I'm a simple person. I don't need to be wild. We have Costco in the PA. Oh, very good. Costco is tons better than Sam's. Never been to a Sam's. Never been to a Sam's. Mm-mm. -mm. I'm seeing a pattern. If you have good quality and work, then it's a success in Europe. <laughs> in Ohio, where you live, no. Oh, man. Hey, Dapper Al, how are you? Woolworths is probably equivalent to Walmart. Okay, good shout, Bubbly. We have two Sam's and a Costco here. Yeah, I've never been to a Sam's Club. I would like to one day, maybe. I don't know. Just to see. What time do you guys open? 9 a.m.? 9 a.m. Because I have some time. Can I fish over here? While I wait? I don't think that's going to work. That's not going to work. I'll fish until 9 a.m. Do you know any European shops near me? Um, Probably not. There probably is, but I probably don't know that they're European. It's probably what it is. Costco is only in the UK, not in Europe. Okay. Costco is the best pizza. Costco is the best hot dogs and churros. I go to lunch at Costco. Hey, Spork. How you doing, Spork? Oh my gosh. Hold that thought. This is a little bit of a rascal here. By the way, I found out that Lily's birthday doesn't show on the calendar. It's 19 of fall. Whoa, hey, that's a that's a big uh big shout there. Lily's birthday doesn't show on the calendar. Interesting. So watch out for Lily's birthday. Also watch out for the animal contest. Don't do it, at least right now, because it's bugged. Interesting. There we go. Red snapper, dude. You got it. We have one in Sweden. It opened last year. Okay, never mind. Do you have Costco in Europe then? 9 a.m.? I love a good hot dog. Me too. I know. I'm so hungry. I would love a Costco dog right now. I take two. No supermarkets near me sell hot food. I live in too small of an area. We have um a lot of different other big grocery stores that sell like... Like we have grocery store... Like there's a grocery store. I forgot the name of it. But there's a grocery store that has like a... Has like a pub in it. Uh, has like a... Has... A burger restaurant inside of it that's kind of like a pub and then they have like a sushi bar you go to where uh, you walk up and then you like place an order and they chop it up there for you I mean you can shop and eat all you want baby glass F thank you oh 1500 yeah oh you need wood for the others I think I didn't need wood for this. Well, I would have been screwed. There we go. 
Oh, it's your birthday too. Don't forget. Pablo. Ah, thank you for the birthday gift. You're very generous. No problem, buddy. I'm trying to persuade my cousins to expand the inn's business. Maybe they could add karaoke, let people choose songs and sing along. They keep turning me down, though. Didn't see the potential, I guess. <clears throat> hey, Pandy. How are you, Pandy? Good to see you. Okay, now that that's all situated. <clears throat> let's go to the museum, drop off the red snapper, and I think I will go down to the ocean again. Mm -hmm. Give him the flower and keep the candy. Should I have given him the flower? Does he like flowers or something? I don't know what Pablo likes. Does he like flowers instead? Homemade garlic bread sounds amazing. I agree. Go with the pasta. Oh my gosh. What's the best part of this game? Everything. <laughs> Very vague answer, but there you go. Flowers work and they're free. Okay, you mean flowers for everyone. Hey, wait a sec. I gave flowers to Yuri and she said, Ew, disgusting cans. How dare you give me flowers? This is pathetic. Flowers always work. Flowers always work. Remember that? That was day one, baby. She is the only one. Oh, so she's special. Found out the other day we can order Subway home now. It's like 30 bucks for two subs. 30 bucks for two subs? That sounds so cheap. <laughs> Holy crap. No. <laughs> Subway's expensive, dude. That is expensive. That place is expensive, man. Subway's not cheap anymore. They can say all they want about nonsense, but it ain't cheap anymore. At least where I live, it's not cheap. It's like a premium, and it's not even, it's like subpar. Not even that good. It's not worth that. I think for Danielle and I to have Subway, she has a Subway, or she has a sub, I have a sub. It's like in a drink. It's like I think the sub, the, the 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 subway sandwiches they go for like depending on which one they go they range between like sixteen to eighteen dollars each. that subway it's not worth it that was danielle's first job danielle's first job was working at subway back in the day back when she was 16 she was 16 she got her driver's license she had the whole world ahead of her she had a forehead at her side and she says i'm getting a job at subway i was so proud of her at that moment i said you go girl Subway is like, oh my god, I'm in a bind. Kind of like, ah, damn it. I need to buy it. I need to get, I need to have something for dinner tonight. Subway here is only 46. That's incredible. That's how it was way, way back, but it's a lot different now. Like, if you go to a Subway at a gas station, you gotta pay at least $16 for a sub sandwich. Go to a subway in a Walmart, expect the same. Subway's low tier sandwich shop, I agree. It had at one point, I don't know if it does now because I think they're closing a bunch of shops, but at one point it was the uh, biggest fast food chain in the entire world. It had the most fast food chains, more than McDonald's did. I think they expand too quickly.
I've gotten sick by a subway too in the past. Like, you know, like a food bug type type thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. That was a hell of a night, I tell you. You should try Zapikakana. What the frick did... What? It's like pizza, but with a bread, not dough. What is it? Zapikakana? Kan, kan? Kan, kan? Kan, kan? What is that? I've never heard of that before. I'm intrigued. Close. <laughs> yeah, subways around the corner from other subways. That's what happens when you are. Uh, that's what happens when you have a very, very simple and easy. Uh, what is it? Very, very simple and easy. Um, I can't. What's it called? Very simple, easy. Um, threshold to be able to open up a franchise subway like some places it takes a lot to open up a franchise i think subway it was like so easy to open up a franchise everybody and their mother was doing it i'm gonna grab that crab got you Pom pom. Maybe everything is so much bigger in the States. That's right. <laughs> there we go. Up we go. What is that cute robot down in the corner? Yeah, he, he he helps me. He helps me around. Only when I'm underwater, though. Not above water. <clears throat> My town once had subways opposite sides of the road and a one-minute walk at a train station. <laughs> now there's only one left. I wonder if there was a lot of heat between the two places. Or if, there, if there was a lot of heat between the two places or if it was the same person that owned two of them. Right, let's go dump this off real quick at the museum. The crab. Domino's is pretty easy to open a franchise franchise store. And you know what? I like do I like Domino's. I went into Domino's like a couple months ago to pick up an order. There is literally 30 people in the kitchen. There is so many people that work at Domino's. It's insane. I looked back there. It was a cl freaking classroom. I don't know how they were standing. I don't know how they were walking, but they everybody was busy. There are so many people working at Domino's, at least where I'm at. Holy crap. I was impressed. <clears throat> Have a good one, Manda. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. Have a wonderful rest of your evening. There we are. Boom, boom, boom. Ah, uh, boom. Scrap. Scrap. There we go. Mm -mm 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 -mm. There we are. Um, we have the ore outside. Yeah, we'll do the ore outside. I don't like Domino's. Little Caesars is even worse. Yeah, even, yeah. I, I mean, I don't like Little Caesars, but I definitely will have it in a, in a bind. Um, uh, Little Caesars does a lot of promos now. Depending on the year. Bye. Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. There we go. There we go. Okay. Cool. And might as well actually do the kelp too. Let's do some kelp essence as well. I used to work at Radio Shack back in the day. And there was a... Um, there was a Little Caesars right next door. It was a Little Caesars right next door or a Chinese restaurant right next door. That's all there was. There was nothing else around. 
And I like Chinese food. We already talked about this, but the thing about the Chinese restaurant is they their orange chicken. I look. I some people say it's very authentic, and I and I tip my cap to you for the uh, authenticity. But I'll be honest with you, I don't like orange peels in my orange chicken. Orange peels are just damned. That's all I'm gonna say about that. We'll hold on to those daffodils. You used to work at Radio Shack and there was a Chinese place and a price chopper next store. So there was, when I worked at Radio Shack, there was, uh, that was before, I worked at Radio Shack until we went out of business, but there was a Little Caesars, there was a Chinese restaurant, and then there was a, uh, come get your tires changed shop next to it. That was it. That was the whole shopping mall or whole shopping center that we had. All right. Uh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Good, good. Rain? It's summer. No, it's the last day of spring. Sorry. It's going to be wet and raining. Perfect. Perfect. That means we're going to be going to the mine shaft tomorrow. Now, before I go to the mine shaft, I want to see, do I have any like thing I can bring for energy? I don't want to use all this candy for this. Um, let's see. Do I have any things I can make for snacks? I could make candy, but my God, my God. Seaweed, scuba snack, I guess more candy. Yeah, make quite a bit. All right, I'll do it. I'll do it to it. There we go. You were there until they closed as well, basically. I missed the battery deals they had. I know I would pick up some batteries. Um, <laughs> the whole joke. Why do I need a phone number to uh, to buy a pack of batteries? I don't know. That's how Radio Shack goes. Uh, go to bed. I agree. I agree on the no orange peels as well. Yeah, man. It just it's it's just not for me. Just not for me, man. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay. When I worked at Radio Shack, we had we were very inclined to push cell phones, which I hated. It sucked, and I think that's one of the reasons why um, Radio Shack went out of business. They wanted us to do so many jobs at once, and they wanted us to be cell phone salesmen too, and that I hated the most. Uh, nope. Trash for drops resources, uh, increases the chance of finding artifacts, double the kelp. Uh, let's do finding artifacts. And then here we'll do chance for watered soil to stay watered the following day. I'll do that. There we go. Cool. All right, on we go. We must go. Not very good pay. So when I worked there, um, back in 2014, 2014, uh, whoops, I should put this stuff away. When I worked back, back there in 2014, we were paid nine fifty an hour plus commission. That was our pay. Nine fifty an hour plus commission. I don't know if that was the same in 2014 or at least, at least maybe when you worked at Radio Shack, but that's what we had. 950 commission. You got up to 14, 15 dollars an hour with commission. That sounds like incredible, but <laughs> even for Radio Shack, it sucks. The only good commission was selling cell phones, man. That was it. I should have teleported to the damn mine shaft. I apologize, everybody. I refuse to shop at Radio Shack. Because they only cared about phones. I mean, it never used to be like that. But yeah, I I, I, I I totally get that. Radio Shack was in its prime in the 80s and 90s. And then they fell into the 21st century. All right, here we go. I hate, I hate push sales. I do too. It's one of the reasons why I don't like, uh, I don't like getting, I, I don't want to get into like getting into like selling cell phones and stuff like that ever again. Because that shit sucks imagine having to like lie to customers on a daily basis 
and imagine having to like try to like upsell that was actually one thing they taught us in radio shack was to always keep the basket going upsell 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 it's like dude i got nothing to give to these people that's worthwhile <laughs> what do you want me to upsell i sold a lot of track phones and boost mobiles though because we had a lot of drug dealers in the in the area <laughs> or did still do but yeah They'd come get their scales and they would come get their track phones, get their burner phones. Super cheap, super cheap, like a, like 50 bucks, 50 bucks to get a cell phone. Mm -hmm. They have an online website again. There's a, um, there's actually a, uh, it's like a couple hours away from me, but there's an actual franchised uh, Radio Shack that still exists. I was thinking about going in there one day just to see what they actually have. I might have to do that. That'd be a cool like members video or something. Go to Radio Shack. I always treated the customers fairly like i would be honest with them i'd be like yo is this really worth it they would ask as long as they were asking questions like let's be real here and i was like okay you want to be real don't buy it <laughs> as long as they you know they kind of hinted to like don't feed me bs i would be like okay i'm not gonna feed you bs it's better to gain the trust of a of a loyal customer <clears throat> um then to like you know sell a, i don't know i'd rather gain the trust of a loyal customer than sell a high ticket item that day hey lizzie how you doing lizzie what's going on i'm getting shafted right now by the freaking hole this sucks Island, is this your first gameplay after the release um this is the first series yes after the uh the release of the full release yes this is day three of our first series after full release if that makes sense yeah dude i cannot believe i have not found this hole yet oh my gosh i'm getting wrecked here Baby, here we go. Not that one. Thank you. There we go. Oh, I love the sound of this. I love the sound that that makes when you uh, actually find a vein. It's so good. I should probably kill these uh, monsters as well. Radio Shack used to sell these little RC cars named X mods or something like that. Yeah. We used to sell a lot of uh, X, XC car, uh, like the the little RC cars, uh, but they were they were a big hit during like the Christmas time too. Let me see, big hit during the Christmas time. There we are. Um, we're gonna have to eat some candy here in a sec. We might have to dip into the stone game. I don't know if we're going to get to the 41 today. I was hoping we would. Mm -mm -mm. Love going into the parts store and all the little components that were there. I used to look at the fuses quite a bit. And just think, huh. When I need to use a fuse... I know what fuse or what type of fuse I need. I love the fuse. They had we had a fuse drawer too. The one thing that sucked though was doing planograms. 
F that noise, dude. Planogram. You can F off with that, my good man. This is your section, Cans. That's what my boss called me. He called me Cans as well. Uh, no. <laughs> this is your section. I want you to do this planogram, but I want you to do it mirrored. So everything you see on this piece of paper, this piece of paper, I want it. I want you to do it reverse. Like what the? F no, Cans. That's not how you do it. I told you, you had to do what the piece of paper says, but you had to do it reverse. But why don't you just give me the reverse version so I know what to do? Why do I have to play with my fingers here? This is ridiculous. This is, why? Why do I have to do a circus act to do a planogram? My God. Plus, I had a manager at Radio Shack who was a manager since the 90s. So he was sitting on a very comfy uh, uh, salary, uh, like salary, uh, severance package and all that good stuff. And he did not give a damn. He didn't care, dude. He did not care that the business was going out and we were going to lose our jobs and he was going to lose his because he's been... He had a very they were grandfathered into this incredible like thing that they had back in the 90s he gets zero f's he's like yeah whatever i don't care we'll lose our jobs we'll lose our jobs so be it <sighs> Shit. i'm over here working part time 34 hours a week because they won't give me the 35 hours because if they do then they have to start paying me full time a holes <laughs> if you you can't cans you can't go over 34 hours if you do we will get in trouble and we have to start considering you as a full-time employee so you can only work 34 hours a week okay sure love the morale here it's a wonderful place Wonderful place indeed. Crazy, dude. Absolutely crazy. Hey, Ruth. How are you, Ruth? How's it going? You got inaccurate planograms. Those are the devils. <laughs> yeah, dude. It sucked so bad. I hate it. I hate it. I just it made zero sense to me why why are we doing the planogram on a piece of paper that's backwards I just don't understand it I just don't understand it does this actually consume energy fighting these monsters no I don't think it does actually Yeah, I think we're okay. Doesn't consume energy. Good. We'll eat some more candy. Yeah, there was nothing the corp uh, the managers could have done. It was just, I think it was more or less the attitude. Like we knew that we were all gonna lose our job, but like, you're getting we're getting paid like pennies, and you're like over here on a ninety thousand dollar salary. At least. I don't know. Spruce up the place. Make the place look nice. Don't like order us around to do everything for you. You know, like, I don't know. Let's go team. Give me false hope so that when I walk into the place for the last day. I realize that I have to now go find a new job and you get to, you know, live off your your package for at least a year or something until you find a new job. Dude, I tell you though, that manager did like me. What can I say? I'm a likable person, but he did like me a lot. And um, as much as the crap I talk about him, he was very lazy, but he was, he, he was a good guy. He just wasn't a good worker. You know what I mean? Um, he was a good guy, just not a good worker. And so when he lost his job, he contacted me like six, eight months after we lost our job. After not hearing from him, he's like, hey, he texts me out of nowhere. He's like, hey, I got this manager job. 
this big role at Lowe's. You want to come work for me? I was like, hell no. <laughs> Except I said it in a very polite way. I said, no, I'm busy. I'm busy uh, painting fences <laughs> in the blazing 110 heat sun. I was like, hell no, dude. Hey, Marshall. How are you, Marshall? Mm -hmm. Take me back to the Tenet series. That's that was Can's di Dear Diary series. That's true. You ever watch my? You ever watch my uh, Tenet series? My first Tenet series. I do talk about a lot, but that was like a that was a Let's Play series where I had to talk about a lot. You can learn a lot from me in that series alone. I think. All right, well, we're going to have to make a move here. I was hoping I could find this a lot sooner. It's not the case. Um, I will make another rope. We have four ropes, five ropes, I think, all together. We're not going to be able to go back today or go for the full 10 today. Next time we come down, we'll have to bring the rest of our rope and then hope we can get to 40. Yeah. That was the tenants game. I played it in early access, and I really enjoyed it. Um... There was some bugs. There was a lot of bugs in that game, but I really enjoyed it. The Tenet series was one of the first games, one of the first Let's Play series that actually uh, grew traction on the channel back in the day. This is like a few years ago now, uh, but they were nice and they sent me like uh, the devs were really kind. They sent me plushies and stuff like that. And they sent me like a Christmas uh, gift and all that last year for what I did a couple of years ago. So um, I do like the Tenets. It's a buggy mess, but you know, it's 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 good wholesome fun i think if you like that kind of thing i don't know it's a good game ish <laughs> it's a good game ish it's good enough <laughs> it's good enough hmm ginger i don't think we need ginger do we no okay we don't need to like drop this stuff off very well I'll hold on to the cursed fragment though. I don't know. Should I keep ginger? It's an herb. Oh, uh, I'll keep it. No, I'll sell it. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. where's my rope? There it is. I have four rope. Sorry, four rope. There we go. <clears throat> I haven't played the tenants since they did the DLC, the pets DLC. They had a pets DLC come out, I think, this year. I never played that DLC. So you can like have pets and stuff. So I thought that was pretty cool. All right, tomorrow's the first. Summer is officially here. One place I worked went bankrupt with no warning. I never did get the payback they owed. With Radio Shack, we, we were going into bankruptcy. We knew it. Every day, us employees would check the stock level <laughs> of Radio Shack and be like, oh, today we just hit a dollar. Uh oh, today we're below a dollar. Get ready. We're going to lose our jobs. Oy, oy, oy. It was actually kind of a sad moment, at least in American history. There's Nina. My lovely Nina. Radio Shack was an American company for well over a hundred years, I think. Oh. Look at Nina. There she is. Hey, Nina. My darling flower, Lily. I miss you so much. It's going to be a fun summer now that you're here. You know, typically I like long hair. She got short hair, I realized. Maybe I'm maturing and getting older. I don't know. <laughs> all right we got to go pick up our watering can today uh that's number one and it's summer hooray summer is here uh we'll go ahead and look at the calendar and all that good stuff and um write down some more birthdays i'm gonna have to like draw a line or something my notepad there we go and the uh, summer music is here 
the thing about Radio Shack is Radio Shack had a lot of similar uh, products to Sears and Kmart back in the day. So I don't know if they were all going through like the same. It was like all made in China stuff. So I don't know if it was like they were all going through like the same like uh, the same. I don't even know the same company, but if you went to Sears or Kmart, they would have the same electronic stuff as Radio Shack. So they all like kind of went through the same. I don't know distributor i don't know what you would call it we'll fish here until 9 a.m <clears throat> here we go there we are come on baby give me another red snapper give me something good give me something big give me something grand my darling flower cans. <laughs> a chub. Thanks for noticing. There we go. Send it. You know, one thing I did, I never got into also, you said raspberry Pi, and it kind of reminded me of the, um, of the, the raspberry cell phones. No, not the raspberry cell phones, dude, the blackberries. Anybody like, have a blackberry back in the day i guess it was like the first smartphone before smartphones a raspberry i feel like business people business women businessmen had raspberries back in the day raspberries right your mom did my mom had a raspberry too dude she had one too your first pc was a tandy 1000 you had a blackberry curve oh I remember my mom having a BlackBerry and, um, and like had that little keyboard, I think too, but didn't it have like that little ball you rubbed that little cursor thing? That's the BlackBerry, I think, right? I'm pretty sure that's what it was. I did. I miss it every day. That was a work phone. Raspberry was the new pager. She. Or like the razors do the razor flip phones those were hot i think those are actually starting to make a comeback i don't know if anybody's noticed that i think the razor flip phones are trying to make a comeback right now there we go now i said raspberry instead of blackberry damn it did i just say raspberry blackberry i keep uh, now look at us both of us are on it <laughs> frick my hubby in had a Gibbs phone for years. Hey, Melina, how are you? Good to see you, Melina. I really enjoy your video and streams very much. Greetings from Berlin. Well, shout out to Berlin. How are you? Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Samsung's pushing the flip. Yeah, they have that like crazy flip. Like, there we go. What is that? Koi. They have that crazy like flip. Um, I don't know, man. They have that crazy, like, flip, like, foldable screen phone. It actually looks pretty cool. But it's, like, $2,000, and that's not pretty cool. Even though this next year, I don't know if anybody has seen it, Apple is going to be dropping, like, the $3,500 VR headset, augmented reality headset. Watch out for that. <laughs> <laughs> Hello from Paris. Well, how are you, Diana? Shout out to Paris. Weird how we went from food to phones. I know, right? The Z Fold. Is that what it's called? The Z Fold? And the Vision Pro is the augmented uh, Apple uh, headset, yeah? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hey, Brittany. How are you, Brittany? What's going on? Coral Island is your favorite. Good to see ya. There we are. Oh, we already have that. There we go. Okay. Retrieve tools. Watering can. Uh, let me put that back. There. Cool. Also, I know I stressed this last time, but if you have a gem, if you have an artifact, and you've already donated it, don't sell it. Keep it. Keep it. Keep it. Keep it. 
Don't sell the extra duplicate artifacts. Don't sell the extra duplicated gems. Keep them. Uh, chance to mine double ores or increases the chance of finding geodes. Oh, crap. I'm gonna go double ore. Yeah. Mm, you could always let Elon Musk put a chip in your head. Honestly, I'd do it. <laughs> and the reason like okay so i'm an iphone user my brother is as a samsung user or android right i don't know what he has a fancy like phone i don't know what fancy phone he has but i need an iphone okay no disrespect to the to the iphone population look i'm part of you i'm part of the iphone population no disrespect but i need a dumbed down ui i need something that has flashy lights i need something to have uh like colorful things and easy for me to operate i'm sorry that's just how it is the android is too damn complicated for me i i i i i don't you know it's too complicated just give me something easy and dumb dumb down version let me have it all right let me write down these birthdays real quick Summer. Summer. Okay. Three. Five. The fifth. The eighth. The thirteenth. Uh, the sixteenth. I'm an iPhone babe. <laughs> I love it. My brother gives me crap about it all the time. How could you? How could you be on that freaking iPhone? Look here. I don't have the patience with the phone. I don't have the patience with the phone. I don't have patience with you right now. Yeah. Okay. Good. All right. So that's all taken care of. So the first one will be summer three. Summer three. Nice. All right. Very good. Um, it is summertime. So let's go to the temple and see our goddess and see what we need to do actually i guess we don't technically need to do that because anything that we get forgeable here oh wait we need to go sam shite hang on let me go to sam real quick mm -mm. you have an android and you think iphones are complicated oh crap <laughs> hey subscriber i have an iphone yeah but i will refuse swift swiftly Thanks for subscribing. I will refuse to buy a MacBook. Even though Danielle owns a MacBook, I will refuse. I hate having to go on that MacBook, man. I do not know what the hell is going on. I stick with the PC. Okay. We're gonna need one of like everything. So we're gonna get one of like everything. Uh, we will go, uh, how do we do this? Let's see here. Okay, blueberries are strong. Blueberries are super strong in summer. So I think we should kind of like double down on the blueberries. They're really strong. I'm gonna go 30. I'm not really, I'm just kind of like, I don't have an idea as far as like, what and how much um like plot wise and stuff oh pot, hot peppers will grow into fall that's a good shout uh like i don't have like a idea of like how many plot spots i'm gonna use i'm kind of just going for it right now sunflower seeds love it obviously i'm gonna grab that And I will be using sprinklers. Yes. I didn't use it the last time we played. I didn't use the cheap ones, but I will be using it this time as we play. I think that's good. 15, 15, 15, 15, 30, 30 on the big ones. And then I have fertilizer at home. 
and I can make fertilizer if I want. Pineapple upside down cake. I'm not a big fan of that cake in real life. I'm not a, I'm not a fan of uh, fruit cake either. Oh my gosh. Hello. Thank you all for coming to today's town meeting. Today's agenda is set up is to set up the next round of cemetery cleaning. Oh my god. Very well. As you all know, heavy rains seem to clog up our sewage. I will take screenshots. Pablo and his brother worked hard to clear the sewers around town. Thanks to them, we didn't have a bad flood. This season's budget will also go into a fixing a leaked roof at the community center. Last on the agenda, the cemetery uh, is showing a lot of moss. And let's face it, I need volunteers. Who's it going to be, folks? I didn't raise my hand. Oh, great. Thank you. Tomorrow at 10 a.m., then meeting adjourned. Very well. Pablo, don't leave yet. At my old university, there's a le like lesson for old people to learn to use an iPhone. That's actually really good. They, I, as much as that might sound bad, it's really good that they, they're, I, there's schools around us too that have like, um, classes where because danielle works with like the older generation elderly and um there's a lot of classes around where uh, you can have the you know older folks go and take classes to learn how to use certain uh, electronic devices and things like that i can't imagine how it would be not like growing up in a generation where technology wasn't as advanced as it is now right um and even like i know i'm young ish but the generation now that's killing it on TikTok and all that, like they're even more superior with technology. Like the kids that are in their teenage years, young adults and things like that, they are far, far more superior than, you know, I am or we are in like the technology game. Before you know it, we're going to be obsolete. But yeah, this man right here, always the first to volunteer. What a fine young man. Here you go, son. Have some of my fish soup. I made plenty. Thanks, Mr. Mayor. I'm just trying to contribute. I have nothing but time. Oh, yeah, I forgot everybody has summer outfits on too now, huh? You have to forgive me for not giving more. Look at you, dear. So humble. Now, you must not think that way. Instead, look at what you have given to the community, which is plenty. What a wise way to look at things. It's always great to hear perspectives from successful people. Oh, you. Always with the compliment. Oh. Ha. That's Pablo for you. Very well. Oh, look at the cat up there. My lord. Get down! Oh. I'm gonna hurt himself. Okie dokie. Alright, so let's go to the farm and let's plant these seeds. No big deal. Hey, Tiffany, how are you, Tiffany? I have been playing for the last few days. The grind is real. You're right about that, Tiffany. Did you play new game? Did you play early access? Or what are you playing? Are you playing PC console? I made blueberry cheesecake for my brother's birthday just last week. Oh, yo, yo, that sounds good. That sounds really good. Okay, uh, let's see if we can actually get into this making of... Well, let me sell the fish real quick. Let's see if we can get into the making of boom boom. Um sprinklers. Yeah, sprinklers. One. F. Oh no, I can make another one if I do some scrap. How many can I make? I have silver kelp. I can make two more. Oh, okay. Let's do that. Let's do that indeed. All we gotta do is recycle a bit. And we'll be good to go. Get that going. Perfect. We'll let that run for a bit. In the meantime, let's go ahead and plant this out. Or plan this out. So, with... Can I actually see... How does this work? I want to see what this covers. Okay, so it goes there. Okay. 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 So, I want to grab this. Going. And I want to do this with it. All right. And then I want to go like that. Okay. 
Yeah, that's how I want. Yeah. You played early access for 70 hours. And you're starting all new on the PC. So you didn't do like new game plus or anything, yeah? Now I want some cheesecake. Now I do too. I do. I want some what what's turtle cheesecake? That sounds interesting. Okay, that should make us another sprinkler. There we go. Cool. Okay. Just that one right there. Okay, let's start hoeing. There we go. I guess I gotta also talk to Nina quite a bit this uh uh, this season last time I played through I didn't talk to her quite a bit this time I need to and then let's get the fertilizer too Oh, it's already done. Never mind. Let me get the fertilizer No, you thought it was kind of cheating a bit. Okay, very good. <laughs> I didn't either. So it's okay <laughs> I didn't do it also um, Let's see. Let's ski fertilizer. Did I put out here? I think Uh, nope. Nope. Wait, where the heck did I put the fertilizer? Oh, no, I used the fertilizer already. Sorry. Okay, can I make fertilizer then? I can. Just a little bit. Not a lot of it. Very good. Okay. We'll go one, two, buckle my shoe. And up here, we'll do all of blueberries and stuff just because... These things will um, grow all year or yeah, all season. Sorry. There we go. So we know these are going to need constant water anyways. There we go. Cool. Mm -hmm. I don't know how far does it go out that way? So let's see. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, it actually does go out pretty well. All right, all right. So right there. Good stuff. Hey, Melita. How are you? Thank you for the re-up. How's it going, Melita? Hope you're doing well. There we go. And then we can put like a sprinkler right there, technically. It won't be very much... E oh, wait. Did I miss a thing thing right here? I did. Um, it won't be very much even. But... It would all be wandered. So there's that for you. Melina! Hey! Thank you for becoming a member, Melina. How are you? Thank you very much for that. Big ups to you. Good to see you. Hope you're well. There we go. And then one lonely little blueberry somewhere. <laughs> uh, that was very kind of you. Very generous of you, Melina. There we are. Place that right there. Hey, subscriber! Thanks for subscribing, youngin. Appreciate it. What year am I on? I'm on year one. One year. Yeah, year one. Okay. Uh oh, I did miss a spot right there, didn't I? Well, that spot. Frick. Damn it. That would have been perfect, now wouldn't it? It would have been. I know I destroyed that, but I'll go buy. Um, no, wait, no, this, this, this one needs to be there. Sorry, I don't know why I just did that. All right, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, this is where the sprinkler is going to go. Sorry. Um. Yeah, this sprinkler, the reason why this one's a little bit different from the others, um, is solely based off of the, uh, scarecrow. So it doesn't, uh, it doesn't, uh, fill in all the way i mean i could put it over here but then some of the blueberries won't be covered by the uh, scarecrow so it's gonna look off a bit but yeah hey lily how's it going hey jesse how you doing jesse okay let's finish the rest of the seeds yeah before i lose time now I might destroy a crop or two throughout the season uh, just to place sprinklers down, um, which is, you know, it's fine with me. I don't mind. Oh, that's bad. This is such a mess. There we go. Oh my gosh. The music is coming through. There we go. 
Okay, now wheat. No order whatsoever right now. I, again, I'm not really focused right now on... Let's do some flowers down here. I'm not focused on making it look nice on this first year go. Not too nice. Maybe eventually I will. Um, but there we are. Maybe a little bit, but I'm just worried about like just throwing stuff down at this point. Now there's going to be some wheat that's going to be out of the scarecrow reach. I know we have one spot right here we could do, but we'll leave the wheat outside the scarecrow reach. It's not too, too important, I guess you could say right now, since we don't have any like animals. I could make another scarecrow too. But I don't know if I want to make another scarecrow right now. Only because I know this is going to be temporary. And I'm not going to, uh, I'm not going to have this kind of layout forever. So I don't want to invest too much into it if I'm not going to use it a lot in the future. Whoops. Okay. That's water. There we go. Hey, Kavastar, what's going on? How are you? Mm -mm -mm. Is it mean to tell you guys I'm enjoying my mozzarella cheese sticks at this moment? It's very mean. <laughs> it's very mean. How dare you? How dare you? And how dare you enjoy those mozzarella cheese sticks without me? What speed of time do you play on? Um, I play on the default. Yeah. Whatever the default is, which I, I don't know what that is. Is that 100% or something? Um, I just play on the default. That's what the... up Yeah, updating the water can. You can make it uh, go farther. Make the water go farther. Mm -hmm. Hey, Flo. How's it going? Did I say hi to you, Flo? How's it going? Welcome in. There we go. I always lose track of who I say hi to. Mm. Don't you need to make flour? I can't remember. Did I need to make flour? I think so. But I'm going to need the mill to do that, I think, right? I believe so. You're eating a very big salad with a roll right now. Oh. What kind of dressing, though? Yeah? People always ask, why do you talk about food all the time in your streams? Because, baby, it's the love language that we can all understand universally. I can sit here and talk about Walmart and y'all be like, what the frick are you talking about? Some of you, some of you would be like, yeah, I know what you're talking about. I can sit here and talk about Target all day. But when I talk about food, everybody's like, okay, I'm on board. We can do this. <laughs> <laughs> there we are all right good wonderful um i will make this last sprinkler too let's do it do it to it perfect i will put more stuff in the scrap machine and we'll slide that bad boy oh wait can i not okay there we go we'll place that right there and that covers the entire area at least for scarecrows and sprinklers let's go ahead and add more scrap about to make grilled chicken with feta salad? What are you doing to me? Are you trying to hurt me? Are you trying to hurt me? I got these dog treats. Uh, somebody sent in dog treats for Bella in a throw blanket recently. And these dog treats, I have never had them before. Oh my goodness gracious. They are the most, okay. The dog treats that we were given, they were like, ho they're a ho they're, we still have them. They're like homemade, baked. I don't know, they're, they're not homemade. Like the, the person didn't make them and send them. They bought it from a store and the store is proclaiming homemade, but damn dude, they smell so good. <laughs> They're the best smelling treats. 
I have ever seen. Ever smelt, rather. Danielle's loved the smell of it so much. She took a bite. Yeah, she took a bite. And she said, this tastes good. Okay, let's go to the mine shaft since it is a rainy day. Um, let me take the rope real quick. Oh my gosh. Don't forget the rope this time, forehead. I don't know the name of them. She said they tasted great. They smelled like an apple pastry cake cookie. I don't even know what it... I don't even know how to describe it. It's so soft. It's so chewy. It's like... Are you sure this is for dogs? Because <laughs> I'm about to have the bag. I should have used the teleporter. I apologize. I used to get brownie treats from a dog food truck when I worked downtown Chicago. Interesting. Wait. Brownie treats from a dog food truck. Dog food truck. I don't think I've ever heard of a dog food truck before. Interesting. Interesting. My mouth is watering. I noticed that your font of the writing is different in the mind game. Yeah, so the way, in case people are wondering also, the way I play this game is one, I play with peaceful on, so hits aggro. And I also play with uh, accessibility with dyslexic font on. So if you want the different font, just uh, choose dyslexic font. Uh, that's what I play. Those are the only two adjustments I've made in this game. Here we go. All right, let's see if I don't get shafted this time. <laughs> Off to a good start. Off to a great start. Here we are. I honestly don't remember what the old, um, old font looks like. I don't remember anymore. I'm still, I think I'm still trying to get 30, uh, 30 mobs, right? 30 enemies. Hammer time. Thank you. There we go. Remember Mossy Stone? Ah, oh, goodness. You. You and that. Never mind. <laughs> oh, I don't need any more. Side, side quest unlocked. Open dog treats truck. <laughs> Kaz does always have his wiki open. And when I mean wiki, I mean chat. That's true. That's true. All my monitors when I'm streaming, like all my monitors are already filled with other stuff. If I have to also have a, a, a wiki up to, oh man, that's all I got to say. There's going to be a lot of things up and going. A lot, a lot. Then I really won't know what the hell's going on. I already got three monitors that are just... Have too much information on it for my own good. Ooh, baby. All right, all right. I'm feeling it. I think this is a 40 run. I think this is a 40 run. Matt and Dew. Love the name. Matt and Dew Gaming. Thank you for becoming a member. I appreciate that. Big ups to you. Hope you are well. Indeed. Thank you for that. Big ups to you. Good to see it. Good to see it. This is the run. This is it. We got it. I feel it. I feel it in the air tonight. Oh Lord. Or something rather. Can you feel it coming in the air tonight? Isn't that like a, that's a Phil Collins song, right? But isn't that Phil Collins song about like? Isn't it like a song based on like him watching someone drown or something? Isn't it there like some weird backstory to that? <laughs> Hmm. 
There we go. Who's the Earth Giant? So that's what's going to happen when we get to level 40. Um, we're going to get the Earth Giant unlocked here. Or freed, I should say. A little, little, there's chieftain tribes in this game. There we go. You believe that's an urban myth? Interesting. This whole time, I might have believed an urban myth then. You summoned me talking about Phil Collins. He said he made the whole thing up. Damn it, Phil. Just like how Susie made up the whole mossy stone thing, huh? Wait a sec. 35? Wait, there's a 35? This whole time, there's a 35. Uh, excuse me. I thought there wasn't going to be a 35. Okay. Checkpoint? No. Lucky? I don't know. What's happening? Going down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it goes up to 40. Well, yeah. I thought there was no break in between 30 and 40. I didn't think there was a 35 checkpoint. I just found another one on that ore. Love that. There we go. There we go. He made that whole thing up. So you're telling me he said that and then he made it up and he's like, oh, JK, LOL. Is that what you're telling me? Oh, it doesn't save an elevator. Okay, 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 okay. So it isn't technically a checkpoint. You're right. You're right, Silver. Yeah, so it's not a checkpoint. Okay, okay, okay. You're right. There's no elevator there. It doesn't take a break. Ah, baby. Baby, baby, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. You are so right. That's a little thing I overlooked there. I love hitting these things, man. Okay. So technically what I could do, I could actually beeline it right now and just like send me. So I'm going to take my time. I'm going to look around some of these. See if there's any gems. Um, see if there's any other ores laying around. I don't need to fight the mobs. There is more veins. I love it. We will be getting the earth giant. It will be good. It will be grand. Excuse me, sir. Get out of the way. There we go. Yep. Give me some of that, too. In a recent interview with Jimmy Fallon, Phil Collins tells him the truth behind the hit song, which is actually about going through a divorce. All right. Well, the more you know, the more you know. There you go. Rope me. Rope a dope. Hey, subscriber. Thanks for subscribing, Shuckamus Gaming. Are those not on console, the veins? Um, no, they should be. Has anybody played console and found the veins? They're kind of rare. They're not like, I mean, they're kind of rare, but they're not like everywhere. They're not always in a shaft. And they might be only down certain levels of the shaft too. I hate that I'm using the word shaft, but you understand what I'm saying. You play on PC and you rarely get veins. I think it's just kind of like luck RNG based. And it might have to deal with like you going down a certain amount of levels first too. Like they might be 10 and below or 10 and higher or something. There's nothing else, right? No. Rope. Mm -hmm. Andrea Bortel Bor Bortorelli. Andrea Bortorelli. Was she known for something? Or was she known for uh, being married to Phil Collins? <laughs> or did she have her own thing going on? <laughs> there we go. Okay. Nothing else. 
Nothing else down here. Here we go, 40. Oh, baby. We got him. You're on the water cave and you've never seen them. Interesting. They're kind of hard to miss. If you're in the water cave, I think there might be silver veins, right? Jamu! Hooray! Earth giant. succeed curse it is that make giant stone clear it human have excited to see other giants I am uh, where is hey, the other giant subscriber thanks for subscribing all day gaming ah giant later come upstairs giant is yeah giant in quotations come human we'll see you it goes earth and then water. Earth, earth, fire, wind. Earth, wind, and fire. Dude, I do be like an earth, wind, and fire. Like, I know September is like, is like one of the most popular songs that might be everybody knows. But like, you go a little bit deeper, you dig a little bit deeper. I like fantasy. Goom, goom. A statue is missing. Missing it isn't. Human. Free is Graga now. Hmm. But where is Grog? Here he is not. Chieftain. Hello, Yolurika. How are you? What's going on? Oh, there is Grog. Oh, little hug. How cute. And I wave and he's like, oh my gosh. Ah, there is human. Wait, human can see Grog? Yes, but nice human this is. Free Grog, because this human. Human this Grog, Earth Giant. Goom goom, human. I, Grog, thank you for freeing me. Hmm, still stone is other giant. Curse again, it must be. Hmm. But fire giant, where? Oh, wait. Is fire next? Three other giants, human, must. Wait, will Grog and I in village. Goom goom, human. Grog is such a cutie. <laughs> nice. So free the water giant. Oh, no. Never mind. Next is water giant. Sorry. Next is water because we saw blue. Um... I'm not going to push it. It's already 6 p.m. We'll go ahead and leave this area. And that will be that. But well, we got to the 40. Good. We got Earth Giant. Hooray. I like how the giants get tinier and tinier. <laughs> all right. All right. More scrap indeed. Scrap me a new one. I will go this. Wow, we have so much bronze ore. That's good. That, that. Uh, put that away. Quartz. I think we need to donate that. Yeah, we need to donate the quartz. Which we absolutely can. And we need to offer sea salt, apparently. Take that, take that. We need to donate and offer Peridot. I think I'm going to donate this first. We need to offer tough meat but i don't think we have enough for that loot yet we need like five of them i believe okay we go like that cool all right and then trash in here good stuff and let me go to the museum favorite earth wind and fire song is reasons I 
I remember a story told by my physics teacher about two meter tall dwarfs. Did it? Okay, so I don't know if you guys seen the hype, but I think um, with Xbox purchasing Activision, I think they're trying to bring back uh, Guitar Ear, Guitar Hero. And um, I had a friend who played Guitar Hero, or I had a friend who owned a Guitar Ear Hero, and I sucked at Guitar Hero absolutely got my ish rock at guitar hero however however they had dj hero did anybody play dj hero that game was sick i played a lot of dj hero i actually own dj hero i kind of liked it better than guitar hero but that was only because I sucked at the guitar. <laughs> yeah, I should throw some of that. I agree. We should get we should get the bronze rolling. We should. I agree. I don't think I have any offerings. No, I don't. Well, I do have the sea salt I can offer to him. Ooh. Ooh, is that a spider I don't have? I can't tell. Maybe. It doesn't matter. Okay. All right. Oh, you need five sea salt. Oh, okay. Okay. Then it doesn't matter then. All right. I'll double check, but if that's the case, I'll just teleport back home then. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. What do I need for this one? All of these, right? Yeah. Shallots. Okay. Back home we go. Hey, Tabby. How are you, Tabby? Finally able to catch a live, getting kids settled, and starting a video from the beginning while I play along. Oh, very good, Tabby. Oh, I love it. Love to hear that. Here we go. Okay. Uh, let's get some of this going. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, uh, 25. Here we go. Five. Perfect. And yep, I would like to get the next thing I'm going to get is a, a pickaxe. Yeah, pickaxe upgrade. Mm -mm. That was a black widow. Was that what a black widow was? Oh my gosh. Okay. I did not know that. Um, I think I'm going to put the sea salt in here. Hmm. Hmm, maybe, maybe, baby. I was okay. I'll put the sea salt in here as maybe a reminder to offer this, and I need to offer a, a a big quantity amount. Yeah, that's probably what I'll do. How much can you customize your house? A lot. Are there a lot of auto farming tools? There are. Okay, let's go there. And I think I'll put the Jamu in there. Yeah, we'll put the Jamu in there. And let's see. Put away the trash. Hey, Stasia. How are you, Stasia? Good to see you. Rain tomorrow? Probably not, but I'll check anyways. Sunny? Okay, turn in. This game looks kind of sweet. <laughs> There's Yuri. Hey, Yuri. Yuri, Yuri, Yuri. Relationship up with Yuri. What did I do for Yuri? I don't know, but relationship up. I'll take it. I like it. If they add co-op, I'd buy it right now. They will. In 2024, they will. But not right now. But they will next year. 90k for stamina fruit from the night market. Oh, my lord. Hands, summer has arrived. I'm wondering if you will be planting some papayas on your farm. If so, please, there, please spare some for me. I need two papayas, and I will give you a premium price for them. Um, I don't think we have papayas. Giants forget human can't enter village. Come to village, I open for human. Very well. Go to the giant village. I shall. There we go. Okay. Place that in there. Do a little bit of this. Um, place a little bit of that in there for now. I'll just leave that in for there. 
uh, until I uh, come back. I don't want to go back into the house. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Go like that. Am I going to play Dinkum again? Eventually I will. When? I do not know when, but eventually I will. There we go. There we go. Okay, that's good, yeah? Yeah, that's good. All right, let's water. Buy my bananas, yeah? Oh, don't kick the tree. That's so bad. Mm -mm. Emma needs papayas for her smirk face. Excuse me? <laughs> she needs papayas. <laughs> Was there a lot of changes with the recent release? It depends on if you... I guess you don't own it, so... I mean, if you mean through early access, uh... Yes? I mean, it's more of a complete game now with full release. You love the new update for Dinkum? Awesome. I've heard good things about it. I still have to add tribute to the sign on the highway? Yo, I think you're far behind. I think I have already. I think you are... I think you're behind. Oh, you refunded it a month ago? Well, then you already know about the game. <laughs> you're, you're good. You haven't? What? I'm gonna have to look. If I haven't, I'm going to scream. But I don't think I thought I did. I could have swore I did. Yeah, thinking about the whole sign thing. I don't know how I'm, how I feel about the sign thing too. I might take down the signs. I don't know. It's very very hard. Or I might put up the signs on a premium because the signs were for members, right? And I there's no way I can keep up with the signs and the members. There's no freaking way. It's so hard. Especially like the materials and everything too. <laughs> How dare you, Ken's? Today is birthday day. Yep, we have birthdays today. Let's see. Valentina and Water Room. Water Room and Valentina. Hey Nikki, how you doing, Nikki? What's going on? What's happening? What's the next game I'm most looking forward to? Oh, God. I don't know. Honestly. There's so many games that pop into my email most of the time. I... I there's a lot of games I don't know about. There's a lot of games I do know about. I, it's so hard to say. It's really so hard to say. Too hard to say. I And, I, and plus, I still haven't even revisited... Uh, Sandrock 1.0 either. You know, there's still that. People want me to go back to uh, Sandrock. People want me to go back to Dinkum. There's so many other things, right? And there's all these new simulators coming out. I have no idea. I don't even have like a, a slight idea of like what's coming up soon. I kind of just like go on a weekly basis. Uh, nope, this is not water where Wateroo is. Sorry. Let's go off to the left. Yeah, off to the left. You take down the mod signs, we riot. <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. <clears throat> there we go. Oh, hello, Macy. Oh, hey, what's up? What you up to? Oh, this. I'm trying to get a picture of myself with the lighthouse. It's for my mom. I don't usually do stuff like this. If I don't send her one soon, my mom will literally come here and drag me home. I can help. Why don't you stand a bit further so we can get a picture of you? Or with the lighthouse being bigger. You sure? Thank you. Yes, please, please, please. Make hey, subscriber. Make sure to thank you for subscribing. Kevin, appreciate you. Please make sure to get to get the top of the building. Okay, yes, we will. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, 
Cheese. Hey, Game Station. How are you? She seems like so innocent, independent, and like on her own. Like, I, I think the reason why I, I don't know. Reason I don't know. <laughs> like, a marriage candidate. I don't want to disturb her peace. You know, <laughs> I don't want to bring the wrath of cans into her life. Right. Ugh. Right. seems so sweet and innocent hmm I don't want to like corrupt her wow these are good you have an eye for these things could you take another one of me uh of me over here the lighting is better yeah no problem did James says did James say this was the last update before 1.0 if that is the case that might um that might uh might um influence my decision on returning to Dinkum or not. There we go. At least for this update that just came out. Now, I haven't in the past, I haven't gone back to Dinkum with every update. Only some, but yeah. Hey, I Kenz, this is one of my favorites. How did you know? Uh, well, I don't know. I did not know, actually. I just wanted to give you some candy for your birthday, my good man. I suppose now that summer's here, uh, everyone's going to be walking around eating ice cream in their bathing suits. Don't care for it myself, actually. Very well. And then Valentina. Let's go to Valentina. There we go. Where are you at? You're at school. All right, let's go to the school. She's at the school. I know I wasn't really keen on giving stuff to the kids, but I'll start doing it. I'll start changing the ways. I'll focus a little bit more. Usually the sweet and innocent ones are the best. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> My mama always told me to pick up a church girl. <laughs> yeah, and that's the thing is that I have talked about when 1.0 came, comes out for Dinkum. I have talked about it that um, when 1.0 comes out, I would like to start over in Dinkum. And so... I think that would probably be the best route to take. I love it. Instead of going into this update, wait until 1.0, start a whole new Dinkum world, because that's kind of what I wanted to do. But we'll have to see. I don't know. Everything is is up in the air. That's all I got to say. I can't promise anything anymore. I'm sorry. I'm terrible at it. I know. I hate to make promises when I don't even know what the hell's going on. Valentina. Thank you, Mr. Cans. I love birthday gifts. No problem. There are more seashells at the beach in summer, by the way. Okay. Thanks for the information. Take care. <laughs> Best way to get silver kelp? Um, Just go to the ocean. Yeah. That's it. Hey, subscriber. Thank you, Daphne. Uh, Daphne. Daf Daphne 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 for subscribing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, progress underwater. That's all you got to do is progress underwater. Just had to change about in Dinkum to add the new stuff in. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Can't wait to get the auto petter the auto petter oh my gosh the auto petter that sounds awesome the auto petter let's see are you still closed you are still closed aren't you monday through sunday wait close on tuesday what's today wednesday close on tuesday wednesdays and thursdays oh you fool goodness gracious antonio what are you doing all right let's go to pablo Pablo, I got some stuff for you. Or I got some stuff for you to crack for me. 
And then I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to see if I can slide in an upgrade for my pickaxe. I don't know how much money I need for the upgrade on the pickaxe. That's the only thing. Okay, they're here. They're just not at the counter. Bonk. Oh my god, that's like the third time I've gotten that thing. Okay, lock it and a red mask. Cool. New stuff. That's what matters. You want to work for that guy? <laughs> All right. Scott, buddy, here we are. I got some stuff for you. I could look in. Well, no. Now that we know that the... I guess the animal festival is kind of bugged. I guess we'll have to wait before we can actually like really participate in it. Kind of a shame, but yeah. Four days on, three days off. Perfect. That's a schedule and a half, isn't it? There we go. There we go. There we go. Nice. We do have a shallot. A shallot is part of the um, uh, temple goddess. So let me go to her real quick. When you gonna play parking? Parking Tycoon? If you're asking when I'm gonna play that game, I would say we have finished it and it's over. We did it, complete it. So no more. <laughs> we did everything we did, could in that game, just about. Um, let's see, Temple Goddess. All right. I think this actually opens up a teleporter. I think, if I'm not mistaken, if we give a shallot, maybe I don't know. Try two days, two nights. Four off for a shift pattern. Two days, two days, two days, two nights. Oh, no, no. I don't think this is going to open up anything, actually. There we go. There we go. Okay. Nope. That will not open up anything. Barn animals, basic cooking. Uh, fruit plants? Can we do... No. None of that. Monster loots? Yes. We could actually do the monster essence. We could do that, no problem. And that, I think, will open up a fast travel. So maybe we should get the um, monster loot or monster ed essence here. Let's do that. I'll see if I can donate that. There we go. There we go. Cool. Cool. That's fine, I guess. I'll leave that there. There we are. Watercress. Yep. I'll hold on to the flowers. There we go. There we go. Um, nope. <clears throat> I think you still have the basement in the parking tycoon. No, it's not in the game yet. It has to be updated. They have to add it. It's not added in the game, I don't think. Um, let's see. Let's see. There we go. Okay. There we go. Unless there was an update a couple days ago, which I don't think there was for that game. Um, yeah, you, you can't add the basement yet. It's not possible. At least when I played last time. Uh, there we go. 20? 20 bars. We'll take the five with us. And I think we can also take this to offer. I don't know how many. Hopefully not a lot, but we'll see. <laughs> let's see let's see wild seeds go in here awesome and back to the temple girl we go yes i say temple girl don't call her a temple girl she's a goddess Am I going to play any Pokemon, Pokemon game? No, no Pokemon games. <laughs> no, 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 I won't be playing any Pokemon games. There we go. I think that opens up. Yeah, no, did that? I thought it did. Maybe it doesn't. 
No. I guess when the other fountain opens up, it's good. I want the one in the middle, the one next to the museum. It's three essence, but I think you should just wait until later to do that. Oh God, am I going to go against your word? I hope not. I don't even know where it would go. No. I think, oh, I guess it would go here, huh? It would have gone here. Never mind. Yeah. Never mind. I think it went, it goes in the fourth one. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, it's the fourth altar. Yeah, 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 yeah. That makes sense. Okay. So I think what I'm going to try to do, I'm going to try to see if I can get, um, a pickaxe upgraded. I'm going to need wood to do this though. So tomorrow we'll do it. Hopefully it doesn't rain tomorrow. If it rains tomorrow, I'm going down to the mine shaft or the ocean. I guess I could go to the ocean. Oh, it's raining. <sighs> I think I'm going to go to the mine shaft. I'm going to go to the mine shaft. Yeah. I'm going to go to the mine shaft. Okay. Is tomorrow birthday? Is it the 4th or 5th? I think it's the 4th. Yeah, it's the 4th. We'll take the... Where's the Jamu at? Okay. Jamu, Jamu. Did I put it out here? Let me put the oars back. I did. Okay. Nope. Oh, come with me. Also come with me. Let's go. On we go. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Scythe that like button? Ay. Is there something you haven't said yet? You've done hoe, you've done scythe, you've done... Have you done water? Have you done wet? Wet that... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> have you done... Uh... Um, I'm trying to think of what I... Oh, pickaxe. You've done pickaxe. I know you've done pickaxe. I don't know if you've done axe. Axe. See, look, there's a silver vein right there. Um, have you done... Hammer? Have you done fished? Have you done... I don't know. You know what? I'm not even going to mess around with this. I'm just going to send it right there. Net that like button. There you go. Net that like button. Let me net it. Let me net it, baby. There we go. Dampen. Have you mo... <laughs> Have you moisted... Oh, no. Never mind. No. Not that. Not the moist word. How dare he? How dare he stoop that low? The one I prefer is tickle the like button. I knew you were going to say that. Huh? Cans. Mm -hmm. Gift that like button. How dare you on the like button? How dare you? If you guys said, let me net it, I would bust it in laughter. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, we actually got something from that chest there. Well, at least we got something. We usually don't get anything from those crates. Man. Domino. Domino effect. Oh, there we go. All right. In we go. 
Was it to five? Yeah, I think it's to five. Nope. We might be able to push through 10 here. Potentially. It'd be nice if we did have the upgraded pickaxe right now, but... You know. You dealt with what you're dealt with. And this was the time to be alive. I do wonder if the if the rainy days are consistent. Like if you did a new save file, are the rainy days consistent on each each and every day? I do wonder that. I think I've asked that question before. Oh, that was lucky. How far can you go down in the mines? I think it depends on the shaft, I think. But I think typically it's 40 on each shaft. It's random rainy days. Interesting. So we, then we just got lucky then. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. I find that the light blue stones work the best here. Oh, don't even get me started. The light blue stones, like these things, the big ones. You're telling me those ones? Would you try the new Sims game in Zoe is the name of the game. I don't think I've heard of in Zoe before. There's another new Sims game coming out in Zoe. <coughs> My sister and I play at the same time in the same day and she might have rain and I won't. Oh, okay. Very well. Is Zoe seems so good. Okay, I gotta see this. Hang on a sec. I gotta look this up. What the heck are you guys talking about? In Zoe? Is that even how you say it? In Zoe. What is this? Not zo- I just typed in zoning. I do not want to zone anything. In Zoni? In Zoe. In Zoe. In Zoe. Oh. Right there. New Sims-like game in Zoe reveals a photorealistic life on Sims. The most ridiculous pretty Sims competitor yet announced this week. What is this freaking shot at? 20 frames a second? Like 15 frames here. The optimization is going to be real here. Oh my god, another game that's never going to come out. <laughs> It's cool. It looks cool as hell. Looks super realistic. Honestly, it's actually something I've always ever wanted in a game. A simulator, at least, right? I think for a game like this, though, you definitely would want at least a game that would have some sort of story with it, though, too. Instead of just aimlessly living life. Because we already do that in real life. I'm going to need a new PC to play this game now. I know, right? <laughs> I 
Wait, can I be cans in cans? Can I be cans in this game? This is the same developer from PUBG? Is this Blue Balls Entertainment? <laughs> I say Blue Balls loosely, of course. <laughs> I say that as a, as a joke. Wow, look at the cat. Jesus. This is crazy, dude. Wow. And what engine is this, I wonder? This is, this is not, un, I don't, this is their own engine, maybe? Wow, you can make a joker. This is Unreal Engine 5? Wow, look at that outfit. That outfit looks cool. Oh, the house building, too. That looks really cool. Oh my god, could you imagine the community this is going to uh, like like construct online? Oh crap, everyone hold on tight. You thought the Sims community might be wild. Watch out. Holy crap. This is crazy, man. It's cool as hell though. My first thing would be optimization though. Is it a, um, will this be a game where it's like, it's gonna be super heavy or not, you know? The music's catchy too. How much is this game gonna cost? $120 potentially? Pretty sure this won't be on console. I think you could be safe to say that. <laughs> hey, coming out on the Nintendo Switch. <laughs> yeah. Is this on the Switch? Don't ask. I'd play it too. But I mean, even when they're like showing the footage here, like the recording, it looks like they're running at like 15 frames, man. They're gonna have their own Sims language too. I think this is also a very, oh my God, there's babies. I think this is a very, very uh, clear picture. Especially if the devs are coming from Battle Royale and the devs are coming from like PUBG and they're getting into the life. Look at the frame on that, dude. The frame rate is so bad. Um, I think this is a clear cut that the marketing for games coming in the future is really going to be coming towards like life simulator cozy. What the hell? Jesus. Life simulator, farming, RPG life, cozy games. I got really interrupted by a slap. Yeah, man, they can't record at like 30 frames. I know it's early build. I know it's early build, but it kind of makes you worry it a little bit, right? That cat is damn cute though. Wow, right. Okay, well, there's no, it's just a reveal. There's no like announcement. There's no like, oh, this is coming out and you know, this and that and that. It's just a reveal coming 2026. Coming uh, 2027, you know what I mean? Stuff like that. 2028. They're only a year into development? What the frick? Wow. Incredible. So that was the first time I ever heard of that game. Interesting. Very interesting indeed.
like waiting for GTA 6 potentially uh, but you gotta imagine the people that made uh, it like I don't know I had to I, I'm just going off of what chat said about them being um uh, what is it them being the developers of PUBG um, you know they have a lot of money to spend because that game made a lot of money a lot a lot of money so they probably got a lot of resources to work with and by the way Sebastian thank you very much for the upgraded membership I appreciate you thank you very much on that very kind indeed very kind big ups to you all right let's see here it's seven yeah let's go like this now that's a sim game I would play and you know there's still even a lot of other sims games coming out sims like games I should say coming out already coming in the future so if I were to put my thumb on it I think that's like the fourth fourth competitor coming soon you know We'll have to see. We'll have to see. Expected release December 2024. I say expected release 2024. Expected early access 2024. With a side of oops. I'm going to delay it till 2025. I'll take that for you. I'll answer you one up there. Hey, Spylight, how are you? Good seeing you again. There will probably be a new uh, Unreal Engine coming out before that launches. I know, right? <laughs> we'll be on to Unreal Engine 6. <laughs> we'll, be on, we'll be on that one. It'd be beta for 2024. You know, I think if they were... So, I guess we have like a topic to talk about here, right? For that game... In particular if they were to do like a beta i would hope that they would do a beta and really maybe give small samples out of like what you can do maybe in the game potentially and have it optimized as hell like right you're giving us a little taste of content but make sure the game runs properly because if you give us like a load of content in the beta and then it's not running properly like that's I think that there's potential I don't know about betas man betas could have uh, they can be good and they can be very bad uh, for games you know what I mean I think early access is kind of the same thing early access could be really good or really bad for games um yeah I miss the days I can't believe we haven't gotten another hit here i miss the days where we had to build anticipation for a game to just release you know instead of like a game releasing early access and then through the early access stages it's funded to complete the rest of the game right it, I, I know it opens the door for many more indie devs and things like that um but i don't know like it's hard it's 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 a hard subject it's definitely hard early access is good for for small game devs that need those funds to continue progress on the on the you know on their games but sometimes early access can be good and bad it can hurt the game or you know not hurt the game i think that's the sad part about it hey vanny how are you vanny good to see you I mean to be i mean we saw it there that video that video it was like struggling to run 20 frames there just to record the game that was the light blue stone i told you Arr. miss when games were released without tons of bugs and glitches especially especially triple a games true it's very true especially triple a games it's hard because even like nowadays i bet you games are way more complicated to make 
and to develop than they were, you know, like freaking 10 years, 15 years ago, right? Hey, Danny, thank you for becoming a member. I appreciate you. How are you? That was very kind of you. Very sweet of you. Hope you're well. No one's talking about City Skylines 2 because it... <laughs> well, I've heard City Skylines, it's it didn't run well at launch and there wasn't a lot of content that a lot of people were expecting, I think, is what I've heard. But I don't know if that's changed over the last few weeks um, since then. But that's the only thing I heard about it. I only heard that it wasn't running as well. It wasn't running well and it wasn't... It didn't have a lot of content in it. But to be fair... City Skylines over even the first City Skylines. The one big thing about City Skylines is it sells a lot of DLC. It always has. So if they put all this content in City Skylines too, then they don't have DLC to sell you later on, right? It sucks, especially when you pay like $50 for the game. But I mean, that's probably what they're going to be doing, right? That's the route they're taking. I miss the Sims where they they can die any moment, even when they are just fixing the lights. <laughs> Goodness gracious. City Skylines got more better and more enjoyable. Nowadays, they don't pay for game testers. They release early access and make people pay to test for them. Yeah, I mean, playtesting, I mean, playtesting does exist, but playtesting is not, um, I guess it depends on what company you work for, but I think playtesters, I, I would like, you would like to think playtesters back in the early 2000s, hell, maybe even the 90s, were, it was like a career job, right? It was like, okay, this could be a career, but then things shifted in the industry. And I think nowadays, I think it's just contractual work, so to speak, you can say contractual, um, where like they just hire some game testers to take them on. But yes, I think there's not as many as there used to be for sure. I mean, think of it. You've ever seen the movie Grandma's Boy? There you go. Perfect example. <laughs> By the way, we got some candy. All right, that's enough. We got to five. Ten. We got to ten. That's good. I remember getting Xbox games, original Xbox games. Um, and in the back of the Xbox game, or even at the main menu of the game I was playing, there would be like a demo for an upcoming title soon, you know? Like, ooh, here's a demo for Jet Set Radio. Ooh, here's a, here, you know, whatever it might be. Here's a, here's a demo for Unreal Tournament, you know? Back to the farm. Give me that banana, baby. Thank you. I don't think I need the banana, though. Uh, no, 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 no. No, we're good. I'll keep the banana, though. We'll keep it for later, but I don't think I need it for a donation or anything like that. Hey, Fifi, how you doing, Fifi? What's going on? Mm -hmm. Why does the bone still say to be determined if this is 1.0 release? I mean, like the other things that are going to be added. Like, okay, so the thing about Coral Island 2 is like, they did talk about how they're going to uh, re... They're going to redo the entire merfolk, Right? I'm very interested how they're going to redo the entire merfolk. Very interested in that. Like, what are they going to redo completely? They said they're going to reconstruct the entire story. I think, right? Kind of crazy. Mm -mm -mm. Mm 
mm, 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 mm. Sunny. Sunny tomorrow. Tomorrow's birthday day, too. Hello, Manda. How are you? You have returned with food. Are you sharing? Are you sharing? There's also main quests that are still work in progress in this game. Is that right? I mean, wait a sec. What? You got McDonald's? Good enough for me, baby. The animal festival is coming up on summer 12. Bring your pet for a fun race. If you have a chicken or cow, enter them in the competition. The event starts at 9 a.m. in front of the community center. Very well. <laughs> Who's got food? Someone feed me. They're completely redoing the Merfolk city. Interesting. Wonder why. I've never really seen it. In the game, there's a main quest that is a pretty big part of the story that is not yet complete. Oh. Is that the dude with the savannah? Interesting. How come that wasn't... How come I didn't read that? How come there wasn't anything said about that? They tied the quest to the savannah area? Wait, is, isn't the savannah area available in the game or no? Wait a sec now. Time out. <laughs> I actually had fries to make chickens last night too. Ditto, baby. There's a bucking bull ride you should try. Oh, I will definitely. They didn't say it. People discovered it by advancing the game. Yeah, no, that's what they should have done. They should have said it. They should have said, oh, by the way, we don't have this main storyline finished yet. It's already 6 a.m. here. Holy crap. I should go to sleep. Have a good night, Michael. Jesus, what are you doing? Burning that, burning that midnight oil. I think you burned it too good. Thank you, Michael. Appreciate you. Have a good one indeed. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. I'm salty that they made us restart, but they didn't change anything story-wise that would have required it. I'm scared they're going to force restart again later on. So the theory behind it, at least when I made a video, people were telling me that the reason why they did the force restart was um, because there could have been potentially new skills, which they're... Uh, there is no new skills prior to early access. Um, people also talked about how the changing of the characters and their dialogue, their story, their outfits, the festivals also had to make it so that you had to restart your save file. But, you know, who knows? I don't, I don't know the logistics behind it, but that's what people were saying. And I kind of go back and I and I, I know I got reamed in the I got reamed in the comment section mentioning it, but I kind of feel bad for the Switch users that didn't get a console release like everybody else did. I understand like, you know, optimization issues, Nintendo and all that, but I mean especially for the people that, you know, did the Kickstarter. Um, and they did Kickstarter and they specifically did Kickstarter for uh what is it for for like their nintendo switch copy um kind of sucks man doesn't it i not much i you know i mean they they offered people they offered people to switch their their switch key to a steam key but what if nobody has it like no one has the opportunity to do that you know what i mean oh i can't do a steam key i don't have a freaking pc that's why i have a switch that's why i got it for the switch that's why i wanted it for the switch right Okay, we're gonna need fruit. I think the blueberries will take care of that. Yeah, the blueberries blueberries will take care of that. And we'll go to the band of slimes too. Slimes? Sorry, smiles. And then we'll make a scarecrow. I think we can make one right now, actually. Can we? Oh, I'm gonna make another explorer one. Sick. Does that hey, count? Subscriber! I hope that counts. I don't think that counts. I don't think that did. 
Hey, lucky one. Thanks for subscribing. That didn't count. Rick. <laughs> right. You try to give the museum donations and the game crashes? Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> hey lucky one good morning from the indonesia shout out to indonesia yeah it's a, it's a, it's an interesting one for sure speaking of museum that teleporter becomes available after the upgrade after the upgrade to the museum right the pick starter uh upgrade yeah i think that, yeah i think you're right about that yeah that makes sense we'll go drop these scarecrows off you kickstarted for the switch but no way i would play anything on the switch wait what you kickstarted for the switch but you won't play it on the switch is that what you mean game crashed a couple of times for you vanny there we go Okay, let's go ahead and throw this down. We'll do this for the future. Yeah. I think I'm going to get rid of this makeshift one. There's no point in having it. It's a terrible one. I think I'm just going to sell it straight up. And then we'll just work with this one. Okay. Off to the side. Maybe right there. I need to get rid of that banana tree if I'm going to do this, though. I guess I could go like that. We'll do this. There we go. Cool. Okie dokie. Artichokey. Uh, let's go to relationships. Birthdays. Connor. Whoops. Let's get Connor going. You are at there. I got you, buddy. I've had this game on my wish list for so long, but after watching the stream, I'm so tempted to buy it right now at this moment. You should. So is it the Savannah quest that's messing it? Like, I don't know. I, I mean, maybe people aren't far enough to say, yes, you can go to the Savannah. Or I'm so confused now. I I honestly did not know that the main quest wasn't fully able to be completed. Uh, I thought, I just assumed that it was since nobody said otherwise. Interesting. Interesting indeed. You convinced your coworker to get this? Oh, good. So good. Uh, process. Here we go. Our ring and stone. F. Okay, Connor, 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 coming right to you. Full release is saying is feeling a lot less full release. And I did mention that. I did talk about that in my video that I made. And people were upset about it. Hey, Riley. How are you, Riley? Good to see you. All I did was read what they gave us. And that was that. The giant quest is still work in progress. Oh, yo, yo. Savannah's going to be... Update in 2024 with new ranch animals to bring the farm. Oi, oi, oi. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Are you back at the... You're in the blacksmith. Okay, you are inside. I'm starting to think that it's not really a full release. Especially when they released a lot of info about stuff coming in 2024. Yeah, it, you know, it could have to do with just like fiscal years and things like that. Um, I don't want to believe it has to do with that, but there's 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 possibility that it has to do with fiscal years and things. You know, I don't know. Some people uh, had theories on maybe the uh, devs were kind of running out of money. And so they kind of pushed full release early ish. To get that little bit of boost so that they can finish out the rest of the game. You know, I don't know what's true, what's not true, or what, what, you know, only the devs know. 
um, only d the devs know, right? We can sit here and talk about theories all day, right? Thank you for remembering my birthday. Betty is right. You're a very thoughtful person. I talked about it. I personally have a video on it. I talked about how it didn't feel full release to me. Um, but, you know, yeah. I talked to Kira this morning about the latest breakthrough in the cavern. Hey, subscriber! I think the town's economy is going to be better thanks to it. Thanks for subscribing, Mira. Appreciate you. Yeah, the you missed the DLC packs. The, yeah, the scarecrows really do come in handy. It do. It do be doing that. Hey, Tech Gaming, how's it going? <clears throat> I'm really disappointed that we had to restart and now we come to learn that the story isn't done either. The story isn't done and they're going to redo the entire merfolk thing next year. Also, uh, they don't have we and we knew about this before 1.0 came out. They don't have the um, they don't everybody doesn't have their Halloween uh, costumes either. So when the Halloween ev event comes through, um, the uh, the NPCs don't have that. That's supposed to come next year when they have um, Halloween costumes and things like that. I'm sending you my favorite fish soup recipe. It was my late wife's. I hope you like it as much as I do. Thank you. That was very kind of you. Eight. Summer eight is the next one. Let's do a little bit of work on the farm. Haven't done a little bit of work on the farm in quite some time now. Clean it up a bit. The only difference between early access and 1.0 is marriage. NPC relationships. The story is this is at the same point. Oi. Bum, 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 bum. Their defense is Savannah, tourist system, multiplayer, children growing up, or kickstart stretch goals. So they are not 1.0 according to them. This was what they promised as a base game. Wait a sec. Their defense is Savannah, tour tourist system, multiplayer, children growing up, or kickstart stretch goals. So they are not 1.0. No, they are. They they claim 1.0. If Yeah, no, they claim 1.0. It was on the Steam uh, store page. Blasted on the Steam store page. Coral Island 1.0 release, right? I'm pretty sure it was. Hey Megan, how are you? What's going on, Megan? Says hello everyone. I'm here to say hello and ho uh, hoping to come to more lives. I haven't fully watched this game yet, but it looks so cute. Been playing Sandrock with family for now. Oh, very good. Oh, with family too. Sandrock with family. That's fun. That, that, that's probably really fun, huh? Love that. That's interesting. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. It's supper, supper time, supper time. Have a good one, Diane. Have a good supper too. Have a good rest of your evening. Have a good weekend too. If I don't talk to you again, enjoy your supper. I might spend a little bit of energy here. Yeah, I might do it. Why not? Let's do it. We'll spend a little energy here. We'll have a little bit of the last bit of. Uh, Jamu. Jamu. There we go. There we are. I'm keeping all the grass, though. Yeah. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. I didn't know about this stuff. I just came in assuming that, um, that the story was all done, at least. Um... I didn't know things were still work in progress. I knew that, you know, some things were not implemented yet in the game. I knew that, you know, Halloween costumes weren't. I knew that, you know, babies weren't implemented in the game yet. I knew that they were going to reconstruct the Merfolk city or the entire Merfolk storyline, maybe. Um, I assumed Savannah was already in the game. 1.0 that's what I assumed but yeah 
they did push uh new game plus but i already talked about that it's not new game plus i think they chose the wrong uh word for it um new, new game plus is not a game feature to coral island and it is only a feature to people that played early access uh you cannot use new game plus if you buy this game on xbox or playstation it's not a feature but it was an update thing but yeah hey lucky one what's going on how you doing how you doing good to see you ah fuck. there we go let's just hope that when the entire storylines are done we won't have to restart again for some people this could be their third time playing replaying the game since a lot of people have also restarted in fall yeah no this is definitely um I, this might be my fourth time i can't remember this might be my fourth time i remember when this game came out in early access it came out in early access and when it first came out i played this game right away like first week and i had to restart because there was their first update they ever did i had to restart my farm because uh they they did an update and they told everybody oh we need to you know we need to start new files again which at the time i was like yeah okay whatever no big deal but I mean, that was a year, over a year ago, almost a year and a half ago now. Do you have chicken and cows for the festival? No, I do not have any festival uh, animals. We've also heard that the animal festival is bugged as well, right? Animal festivals bugged. Um, whose birthday is bugged also? There's another person. What, what was the person's? name that had their birthday bugged which person was it I forgot who it was it's hard to keep someone to marry to it's hard to hard to get someone to marry you in this game they keep saying they are not ready for a marriage really oh oh lily lily's the birthday bug lily doesn't show up on the calendar got it Hmm. Looking at their roadmap, it does say 1.0 release, and after that, to be determined, has the things they said will be coming, like the spooky day outfits, the multiplayer, merfolk stuff, and etc. Yeah. Um, they put in the winter outfits. I kind of mentioned, like, if they put in the winter outfits, you'd think they would be able to just put in the... Uh, the you know the um the halloween outfits too but i'm not a game dev i don't i don't know how these all work i can only sit here and complain and speculate <laughs> that's all i that's what they pay me the big bucks for they pay me the big bucks to sit here and complain yeah there we go good 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 uh flowers They chose to add wedding outfits first. Hmm. Yeah, I still, yeah, I still love the game. The game is still awesome. Don't get me wrong. Still love the game. I just honestly, when, <laughs> I wish I could find the stream. There's an old stream that I have playing this game. And at the end of the stream, I talked about uh i think it was when the game first came out it was like one of my first series i did on coral island and at the end of one of those streams i sat there and i talked about and i predicted this game would go 1.0 in the first quarter of 2024 i honestly thought this game was going to go 1.0 in like march of 2024 that's what i was um predicting the entire time um seems like i was off by a few months and who knows? Maybe they were too early. Maybe they weren't. I don't know. You could be the judge on that, right? But with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, and everybody in between, that's going to do it for today's stream of Coral Island. That is the three hour mark. That's where we're going to stop it in today. If you enjoyed what you saw in today's stream, make sure to hit the like button before you do leave. You can pick up this awesome hoodie 
this tie-dye hoodie on my website just be yourself it's super comfortable super heavy duty durable it's a nice quality sweater i promise you beautiful quality sweater follow me on twitter follow me on instagram for all you members don't go anywhere we'll be uh playing some jackbox here shortly so if you are a member of the channel we will be live streaming jackbox here very soon so hopefully you are here to hang out with us and just go on about antics and have fun yeah but we'll be back with gaming next week next week we have a few things going on a uh, few returns of games um continuation of some let's play series that we have uh new games popping up also steam black friday sale holiday sale happens on the 21st that's happening next week and uh, like i said there's a 1.0 release that came out this week that i would like to return to this game uh, because i really adore it i will not say it now and i will let it be uh, but there is a game i want to re uh, return to for one point for their 1.0 release not sandrock <laughs> i mean i do want to do sandrock anyways there's dinkum updates there's sandrock stuff there's this and that and there's everything i can't keep up i tried to but i i just i can't have a good night everyone if i don't see you in the member stream then i will see you next week or maybe tomorrow i don't know yet i haven't decided i think maybe tomorrow i'll probably see you tomorrow or something we'll have to see i might take two days off do you think i should do you think i should take a sunday and a monday off what do you think should i spend time with the wife what do you think i should do should i do that should i what do you think should i come back on on tuesday what do you think should i take a break should i take a rest two days off yes please i should do it <laughs> should i take two consecutive days off i don't know i don't know i don't know <laughs> i guess i'll have to i know the moderators are like yes please i'm tired of going to bed at two in the morning that's all i got for you have a good one everyone and i will see you soon members all right let's go she said we better of his best friend